In today's video, we see over 50 vendors from the California Overland Adventure and Power Sports Show. So hi, we are here uh, from Boxio and we have a, a whole system of stackable products. Uh, we bring you the portable bathroom to every place you want it to be. Easy, lightweight and durable box. Um, it's a portable camping sink. So you just pressure up with, uh, your, with your muscles. Um, then you just open the water tap and you have uh, flowing water for washing your hands, cleaning your teeth, uh, and so on. Inside the box, we just have a, a 1.3 gallon fresh water tank and a 1.3 gallon waste water tank. And so with this, you can save a lot of water and have your bathroom always with you. Yeah, so our camping sink, it's not only a sink for, for washing your hands or brushing your teeth, you can even use this as a shower. Therefore, you only have to swap the tap with the shower head. So it's easy to just plug it in, um, build some pressure, open the tap and open the shower head. And then you have five minutes of flowing water to uh, yeah, just wash your hair or clean your feet after a nice day on the beach. If you want to have some, some more comfort, you can also add up a nice bamboo cutting board which brings a good look and which uh, yeah you can use in the in the kitchen to cut some some vegetables or stuff like this and as you can see these boxes are stackable and besides the camping sink we also have maybe world's smallest lightest and most durable portable composting toilet which works really easy just by separating the pee and the poo so you have uh, your urine going to the to the urine lid into a canister so uh, yeah you can you can easily dispose it you have a feces canister in the end where you can put some of our uh, odor binding hemp litter which dries uh, all the solids so you have no odors no problem and with our Biodegreeable bags, uh, you are able to yeah, dispose this trash to the next trash bin. And you don't need any chemicals. You have a, a really convenient thing. It's uh, durable up to 330 pounds. So it's so well done that you can easily stand on it and reach whatever you want to reach. Or take our seat cushion. And with our seat cushion, you can just sit on it after a long day beside your camper and have a have a good time so our products can be ordered online um, the camping thing starts at 229 and the portable toilet starts at 199 and you even can get some of these empty boxes just for uh, storage reasons um, for for 30 bucks yeah everything is online on myboxy.com and yeah you can follow us on instagram to see some inspiration i think we have some really great customer feedback we are coming from europe uh, from Germany. All the products are yeah, made from recycled plastics, uh, made in Germany. And we're now hitting the US market and uh, are happy to be here. Hey guys, I'm Joey from Explorer Bear. We're a local 12 volt fridge company right here in so uh, SoCal, city of industry, California. Uh, we have two different lines of fridges here at the California Overland Show. We have our EX series and our UR series. The EX series is a little bit more popular for like the Overland side of the family. Uh, runs 12 volt directly to your AC and DC, while our Urban Series is battery operated. So we can run two batteries that we sell uh, directly through the unit. You get about 60 hours of life directly off the batteries. And then we have a very single silhouette for more of like the Overland Series for people that keep their uh, fridge more dedicated directly into their rig. But we're super excited to be here. It's been a great event, great turnout. Everyone loves our compact 10 liter too just for daily use. So we're excited to be here this year and to continue forward and see what next year has uh, for us as well. So super glad to be here, guys. We're at explorebear.com and on Instagram, explorebearus. Um, all the prices here is what you see on our website. So we try to keep a very solid price anywhere from ranging for $5.99 for our dual zones down to $2.99 for our 35 liters. What's up guys? This is Anthony from Grill Game. I'm going to show you how the G1 7-in-1 grill and smoker works. Uh, you can use the seven ways. Runs on propane, charcoal. Use it right over a campfire. It's got a traditional grilling surface as well as a flat top griddle. 
could use it as a stove. If you're camping somewhere where you can't have a fire, it also includes a fire pit kit. So you can hang out, stay warm. Whole thing breaks down and fits inside the lid. Take all the parts, even the propane, all the components will nest. Drop it right in here, just grab it and go. Whole thing with everything included is about 25, 26 pounds. Um, super portable, checks a lot of boxes, lets you leave a lot of stuff at home. So you're not dragging around a fire pit and a stove and a barbecue. So yeah, if you're tied on space, if you like to get out and grill, it's a really cool option. Dump your charcoal right in. You got some time, you wanna do some smoking, drop the smoker plate in, divides the firebox, throw some charcoal, some wood chunks, start smoking. All the components are modular, so you just drop it in however you wanna use it, just grab it and go. Generally on the website, they're 409. Show special is 260. Still new, I'm making myself, uh, design them. So I'm just trying to get my name out and see what people think. All right, guys, well, thanks for checking it out. Again, my name's Anthony with Grill Game. You can find us at grillgame.com or on Instagram at grillgame. Uh, yeah, check us out, thanks. What's up, guys? We're out here at the 2024 Overland Expo. My name is Bryce with the booth Grip Clean here. We have a bunch of off-road cleaning products for you guys. So if you get your Jeep, side-by-side, -side, motorcycle, anything dirty, we have all the products to get it clean. Come by, check out our booth, and thanks for checking out the event. Grip Clean, all natural, heavy duty hand cleaner, removes grease, grime, oil, you name it from your hands. Awesome product right here. Heavy duty hand wipes, these things are great at removing tree sap. Maybe you're out camping out in the woods, you guys get some sap, uh, fire, ash on your hands. This stuff is phenomenal, cleans all types of stuff. We have our foam cannon here. This thing is awesome. It hooks up to any standard pressure washer and then all you gotta do is put some soap in there, dilute it out with some water, spray your entire vehicle down, trailer, you name it, head to toe. Rinse it off and you guys are good to go. Really cool product, really cool. We got all types of show specials here, anywhere from $10 all the way up to 80 bucks. You can find any type of cleaning package that you're looking for. Check us out. All right, I'm James with the Jet Boil team. I wanna show you our Genesis stove. So this is our stove that's kind of built for overlanders. The cool thing about the Genesis is that it's a clamshell stove. So what that means is that it folds up different than any stove you've ever seen out there. Folds up like a clamshell. And what's really, really cool about this stove the entire stove packs in like that. You got your lid for your pot and you got your pan. So at the end of the day, you have your whole entire two burner stove, pot and pan, packs into itself. Comes with this nice carry case. This is the same thing loaded up. And there you go. You got your entire Overland kitchen just like that. So yeah, these run at $400 uh, on our website, but a great, great option, you know, if you're looking for a whole kitchen in one small, small uh, compact setting. Hi guys, I'm Nick with Clean Freak. We are the antibacterial body wipe. We come individually wrapped for the full body wipe down. You've been out all day, you've been camping, you pull this out, it's a shower in your pocket. You've got no alcohol in here, you've got aloe, witch hazel and chamomile. So you get that nice soft feeling once you're done with your wipe or your, your activity. We got you covered with the Clean Freak body wipe. So our wipes, they come in six different scents. You've got lavender, peppermint, coconut, scent free for the hunt. Uh, citrus and tea tree. All fragrances are from essential oils as well, so you get the benefits of that. There's no perfumes. So we've kept it as kind to the skin as possible. So you always have that fresh feeling afterwards, not that sticky, filmy feeling you get in comparison with other wipes. So thanks guys for stopping by. If you want to pick up our product, you want to go to cleanfreak.com. And if you put in you stink, Y-O-U, stink, one word, you get 20% off at checkout. My name is Frank Falcone. I'm the CEO and founder of Falcon Industries and we're here doing business under the Falcon Overland banner, as that's a, this branch of products that we have. What we have here is a collection of fridge freezers. And what these things do is these eliminate the need for carrying lots and lots of ice when you want to spend a lot of time in the outdoors, a lot of time off grid. So we have some fridge freezers of varying size from 45 liters, 55, all the way up to 75 liters. This fridge here is unique. It has a, a freezer and a refrigerator, and it can freeze things down to minus 4F. So if you need to, you can turn the whole thing into a freezer and freeze everything you have solid. Uh, we have fr some freezers that actually have batteries, so they'll run themselves, so your vehicle doesn't have to. And then if you look over here, we actually have a different form factor of freezer, which is what we call a drawer style. Some vehicles, smaller SUVs, for example, prefer the flat style of fridge where a drawer pulls out, where you can build a sleeping platform on top of it. 
some vehicles that are taller, they of course they prefer the taller profile. So we try to supply something for everybody. Thank you very much for watching and taking the time. I'm Frank Falcone and this is Falcon Overland. You can catch us at falconoverland.com. Hey, I'm Danny with Freedom Ropes. We're here at the Overland Expo at the Fairplex Arena. We've got everything from winch line, winch rope. The best seller going on right here is probably the three quarter inch by 20 foot Kinetic Energy Freedom Rope. Awesome rope, you get seven feet of stretch out of that. Takes the shock, the jolt out of the pole. Much safer, much better way. We got everything up one inch to inch and a quarters for motor homes and toy haulers. We got ratchet straps. And if we come on down here. So this is our, our newest product, really. It's a four-way air up or air down system. So you hook up to your air compressor line, got your gauge going there. This piece that slides up, that airs your tires up, slide it down and you can air them down when you're hooked up, if you got a couple that are a little bit different in air pressure, this will equalize the tire pressure on them. So super quick system, works really good. Locks on in three different places, put it on and it locks on, holds there, works really nice. We're doing these for 150 at the show. So if you get a hold of us and say, hey, we saw something at the Fairplex Arena for the Overland Expo, we will honor that price for you. We also have our air gauges, our screw-on deflators, and our quick deflates. So whatever you need, come on down. We got your product. Guaranteed, American-made, best product you can get. Hey everyone, I'm Elias Brown. I'm one of the co-founders of a company called Thor's Lightning Adventure Gear, and I'm coming at you from the California Adventure and Overland Show in Pomona, California. What we've got here is our compressor lineup called the Lightning Bolt. We've got two models. The first model is this guy right here. Total control technology, 10.6 cubic feet per minute, allows you to set your target pressure. Once this compressor hits your target pressure, it shuts itself off. The second model is right here. We lovingly refer to this guy as the standard compressor. No fancy technology. However, it comes with a single tire digital inflator and deflator free of charge. And that allows you to make sure you get the exact pressure you want in your tires. 10.6 cubic feet per minute, one of the fastest compressors on the market, will air up massive oversized tires in just minutes. Let me show you some other stuff. The next product that we've got is our four tire rapid air system. And this allows you to air up and air down all four tires on your vehicle from one point of contact. We call that the Thor's Lightning Hammer Manifold. It's located right here. And what you're gonna do is simply open your ball valve the air will come out right here and you can deflate your tires all four at once. It's going to give you a pressure readout. You're going to be able to equalize all four tires to make sure they're the exact same pressure. And this system is compatible with any air compressor on the market. Depending on what compressor you have, you can chop your air up time down to as little as four and a half minutes for 35 inch tires, adding 20 pounds of pressure. And then we've got mounting systems here for our compressors for different vehicle makes and models. This right here is the Toyota Tundra mount, and that allows you to take your portable compressor and hard mount it into your vehicle with the Thor's Lightning wiring kit. We also have the Thor's Lightning Refuge bed rack system. This is a game changer because we powder coat it to any color you want. Thousand pound static weight dynamic, 800 pounds, and uh, zinc dipped. So what that means is instead of a zinc coating, it's actually dipped in zinc so it won't rust on you. So that's the whole suite of the Thor's Lightning family. Please check us out, thorslightning.com, and come see us at next year's California Adventure and Overland Show. Hi, I'm John with White Knuckle Off-Road Products, and uh, we uh, make rock sliders for various vehicles. We make heavy-duty rock sliders uh, from Rams to Toyotas to Jeeps and uh, Nissans and many other vehicles. The one up here we have is for a Jeep JLU and we have a few different options for this as well so that you can keep your Rubicon rails, you can take those off, you can keep, uh, make these at a 45 degree angle. Uh, we offer those with the DOM tubing. Uh, some of the larger ones down here, we offer these with a 188 outer wall tubing, which is much thicker and uh, can take a lot more punishment. Um, our main rails on our larger vehicles are a 250 wall, whereas these are a 188 wall. So we make them big, we make them beefy, we make them heavy. So we also offer the top plates. We do offer a diamond top plate as well as the dimple. 
And we also offer uh, angles on most everything. Some of the larger trucks we don't, only because it'll interfere with the doors. Uh, everything that we offer is bolt on. Thanks for watching, and you can find us at whitenuckleoffroad.com. And uh, you can find us on Instagram as well, at White Knuckle Off Road Products. What's going on, guys? Uh, my name's Cameron. I'm from Weston Automotive and Super Winch. We're out here at the uh, California Overland and Power Sports Adventure Show. The products we have out here is that uh, we're representing for Super Winch and Weston Automotive. So on the Super Winch side of things, we do winches for all kinds of vehicles, trucks, SUVs, ATVs, and UTVs as well. And uh, we also have trailer winches and small portable winches to go. Uh, on the Weston side of things, that's going to be a lot of your harder products, uh, bumpers, steps, grill guards, all that good stuff. Uh, so we pretty much have a little bit of everything for pretty much any vehicle you might need. So one of the products we've got on special out here at the show is going to be our SX series winches. These are our newest and hottest line of winches that we have. We offer them in 10 and 12,000 pounds. Um, and like I said, both of these are going to be synthetic ropes. And the cool thing about the synthetic is that it comes preloaded with a wireless remote. So you get both remotes, a wired and a wireless. It also has a drum light. So if you're ever caught out there at night and you need to use your winch, it'll fully light up everything and you can see what you're doing. So just one of the many products that we have out here to offer, but it's also one of our most popular. Also out here at the show, we're also featuring all of our recovery gear. As you can see, we've got synthetic uh, kinetic recovery ropes. We've got wireless remotes that you can add to any winch. Our traction boards, tree trunk protectors, bow shackles, soft shackles, pretty much anything you might need for recovery, we have it out here at the booth as well. Hey, how's it going guys? It's Rugged Radios here. We got our GMR25 right here, our G1 and our GMR25. These mobile radios will be hard mounted inside your vehicle. They come with vehicle specific mounts like our Jeep JK, JKU, or our JL and JK. We also have some mounts for Broncos, Raptors, Tundras, and Tacomas. These ones right here, depending on which one you get, you'll probably get 10 to 25 miles, ranging from a 25 watt all the way up to a 45 watt. And we also have some handhelds over here. And then these are your three color choices for our handles. The handhelds, these are our GMR 2s. Um, they have an antenna that you can remove. You can get, get a remote installed antenna on top of your roof. You can also do hand mics and a whole bunch of accessories that we have built around the radios. Uh, they have a six to eight hour battery life, depending on how much you transmit. Another cool thing is that they have repeaters out there that you can hook up to them and they give you boost your range up to at least 10 to 100 miles, somewhere in between there. Again, it's uh, Rugged Radios. You can find us on our website, ruggedradios.com. Just feel, feel free to give us a call and answer all your questions for you guys. Hi, I'm Eddie. I'm the founder and owner of Canopy Buddy. And this right here is the quad. This is a versatile light, serves you five different functions. You can set it on the table, it'll light up your table. You give you a table space back, so you have adjustable legs, so you can lower or raise it depending on your height. You can flip it upside down with these hooks. It'll attach to the top center of your canopy and give you a top-down light, giving you a table space back. Uh, you could even set it on the ground, light up your surrounding area. It's versatile, multifunction. You can put these legs in, pop out the handle. Now you have a handheld lantern you could carry. These bumpers allow you to set it on the side, or you could even angle it with the legs. And now you have a directional spotlight. And if needed, you could charge your cell phone off of it as well. So it's five different function in one product. So in up top right here, we have the vault. It's a motorized lockbox and canopy light. You put your personal passcode into this remote control, hit open and it'll lower down to you. Now you have access to your cell phone wallet keys, whatever you need. You can pause that at any point in time, grab your items, hit lock, and go right back up top. So as long as your canopy is within eyesight, you're free to move around with peace of mind that nobody's gonna swipe your stuff while you're busy having a good time. Uh, that's the lockbox feature and also has a top-down light so you can light up your canopy and your campsite from inside your tent or trailer. Remote works up to 32 feet. Well, thank you guys for watching. Check out canopybuddy.com and check out all our products. Good morning, guys. This is Sam with Maglite here at the California Adventure Overland Show. Here showcasing some Maglite product here. First, we got the Maglite ML150LR, 1,082 lumens, two and a half hour recharge time from a completely dead battery. And then we have the, uh, the Shorty, which is the ML150LRS, 800 lumens with an hour and a half recharge time. Retail, you're looking at about 120 to 130, depending on the model and the features that you need it to have. The second tactile offering, a rechargeable offering that we have is a MagTac rechargeable, 671 lumens. The cradle was designed to sit inside of your cup holder when you're charging in your vehicle. Uh, micro USB out to either your wall adapter or your cigarette adapter. 
uh, two and a half hour recharge time. And this guy retails for 99 for the crown bezel or 89 for the uh, plain bezel. What's up everybody? Eric with Turtle Box Audio. We're here at the California Overland Adventure and Power Sports Show. Gorgeous day. And we're out here providing some tunes for the event. We've got the Turtle Box Gen 2 waterproof Bluetooth speaker. Only marine grade portable Bluetooth speaker out there on the market. You can pair two of them together. It gives you true left, right, stereo, surround sound. Max volume gets really loud. And then it floats, completely waterproof. And like I said, marine grade. So salt, fresh water, dirt, sand, dust, none of that matters. You're good to go. So all you gotta do is turn it on, pair it to your phone. It'll make a beep noise letting you know you're paired up. And then you can start jamming out. Max volume nonstop playtime is about eight to 12 hours. At half volume, you're looking at 20 to 30 hours of playtime. So plenty of battery to charge it up, take it out on your adventure for the three day weekend. Don't have to worry about charging it. Don't have to worry about rain, weather, environment, and know you're gonna have good background tunes to your entire trip. Retail price is $3.99. We've got some different dealers in California that you can go stop by and pick it up in person at as well as you can go to turtleboxaudio.com or our Instagram at turtleboxaudio to learn more and place an order. Hi, my name's Ryan with Vulcan Bikes. We're here at the California Overland Adventure Expo in Pomona, California. Today we're featuring some of our electric bikes. Right here we have the OG. It's a dual motor, dual thousand watt motor, dual battery, full suspension e-bike. It's uh, very rugged, built for the trails. Good things about these bikes here, we. Uh, source the best parts. Uh, it's a seven speed Shimano gears with a uh, Tektro disc brakes. They go 55 to 110 uh, miles on a full charge, depending on how you use it. Um, it comes with five gear pedal assist, uh, throttle, full twist throttle. Max speed is about 40, 40 miles per hour. We have the OG. This is the main bike we're uh, featuring here. Then we got the Lil G, single 750 watt motor, single battery. And then we have the Breeze here. It's a step-through foldable e-bike. This one goes about 71 pounds. This is about 78 pounds. And then the OG is 103 pounds. And that's our bikes that we have to show you here. You can see, uh, find us on VulcanBikes.com, Instagram, Vulcan.Bikes, Facebook, Vulcan Bikes. We also have a YouTube channel and we're based out of Torrance in the South Bay. Thanks. All right, here we got the everything rope. It's a shock cord rope that's a UV resistant and we have uh, stainless steel all hardware, so it's UV resistant and it won't uh, rust. When it's five feet long, it'll stretch up to nine feet and you can come back through and use it for multiple ways. Like one way to put it like on a, uh, put your surfboards on the top of your car, your roof rack, you could go ahead and put it through on a loop and anchor the one side. And then once you put your surfboard on, you come back through and you can go to any section right here and you can get whatever tension, whatever size you want by going to each anchor point. So it's a, it's a everything rope for anything you possibly could uh, want to tie down on the top of your car or your bikes, back of your motorcycle, just a great item to keep in the back of your car. They also have integrated heavy duty Velcro on each side to where you can utilize this as well for an anchor point or to web more than one uh, string together. Brake strength on these things is they're doubled up. So the brake strength is over 300 pounds of brake strength on the rope. They come in the case right here, a nice little case with uh, one rope and you get two of the carbonier clips and then they all fit great in this little case right here. And you can get them at everythingrope.com. Hi, I'm Troy uh, with Just In Case Rescue, and we sell trauma first aid kits for outdoor motorsports and adventures. Currently right here, we have our Elite Kit. This is our bread and butter. This kit could cover everything from bumps and bruises all the way to major lacerations. Our next kit below that would be our Elite Pro, and this is basically an EMT in a, in a bag. Um, this is more for the adventurers who have side-by-sides, they like to get out. They like to overland and be away from um, you know, civilization. So this is gonna have everything that you need for arterial bleeding and anything for stop the bleed. So that's gonna be our, our uh, next biggest kit right there. We also sell individual items. So if you wanna put something together yourself or build or enhance the kit that you have, we have those items. We also sell Narcan. 
uh, with the opioid overdoses that are going on now, uh, Narcan is a huge thing to have and, and we sell it, we have it. Uh, I'm a Stop the Bleed instructor, so everything that I sell is EMT, paramedic, and first responder rated. Um, we don't use anything off of Amazon or eBay. Um, you won't find our kits on Amazon and eBay. We build them custom made um, out of my home. So these are all custom made kits. We have everything from our happy hiker all the way up to our EMT in a bag. So we have a little bit of something for everyone to cover any sort of activity level that you might, um, you might be doing. So we are a veteran owned company. Uh, I was in the Air Force from 88 to 92. Again, I'm Troy with Just In Case Rescue. I want to thank you for watching and taking a look at our product. Please visit us at www.justincaserescue.com or follow us on Instagram, justincaserescue.com. Thank you. Hi, my name is Arthur, and today I'm with the Huswain to promote the self-powered portable heater here. It has 1.2 liters of diesel fuel that you can fit in, and it can run 15 hours on a single charge. It also has a self-generating electrical heater in here that needs a jump start required by the batteries we sell here. <laughs> to start with the batteries, comes with a charging kit that we charge the batteries with, and then we plop them in here. Once the batteries get in here, they will allow the generator to jump start and start the product here. It comes with two of these little tubes, so you can divert the heat into your tent from the heater. And we also have the exhaust right here. With these protectors, we can also prevent the exhaust from harming anybody due to the heat. This thing is, uh, is priced at $1,500 a box. Thank you for watching. You can find us online at huswain.us. Hey guys, my name's Pete Polanski here at the Overland Show out in Pomona with Anetic Outdoor Performance. Everything we do is built to be as lightweight and breathable as possible. Our focus, whether it's a button up, a pullover hoodie, one of the pants, one of the shorts, same focus across the board and keeping it lightweight and breathable. As a whole, our, our focus is the ultralight outdoor products, uh, growing up in the heat and sun, knowing that, you know, being protected from harmful UV rays is a essential part of staying comfortable when you're doing the things you like outdoors. So we're really happy to uh, create products that other people are stoked on too, but all based on that basic functionality of, um, you know, really creating your own shade and being comfortable out in the elements when it's, uh, you know, when it gets extremely hot. So this product has been featured at the show. It's a great uh, crossover piece, whether you're out on the boat or out on the trail or um, camping. It's a, a cool fusion between two fabrics that put together there to create a, an ultralight outdoor breathable, real teched out product with all these cool uh, pockets. Features like the thumb hole, the hoodie, back right pocket uh, with the combination of those two fabrics really make it a unique piece and separate it from uh, other products similar to that in, in, um, in, their, in their own world. The Rome Pant has also been another product that um, we've uh, highlighted here at the show and has gotten a lot of great feedback. Similar to all of our tops, the focus is always lightweight breathability. And uh, this pant is great whether you're traveling, daily transit, long distance, out on the boat again, or just cruising for a hike, morning walk. It's just the most comfiest pant I've ever worn personally. And um, we've gotten a lot of really great feedback from everybody here at the show who's uh, grabbed one, either bought it yesterday, came back to the booth, already wearing it, saying it was you know, a great purchase and just completely stoked on the product. So it's good to see that feedback. Um, and again, make it available for people who had no idea um, something like that existed. So you can um, find us on Instagram at Anetic Performance and then online at anetic.com. We're here with Rig Supply. This is our Ultra Swing tire carrier that we have on display here. This is specifically the Mega Fit Ultra Swing. Features our Ultra Latch, which is the patented 500 pound compression latch, as well as our secondary Fidlock pin system. So as you, you pop the latch, pop the pin, reach around, you can swing it out. You can do up to 250 pounds on the swinging arm, as well as a 40 inch tire. 
The price is $14.99. It's still a tow rated lower receiver, so you can still tow up to 10,000 pounds out of it. So this is our ramble rack on our ramble swing. Basically, it's our swing out that can do swing either driver or passenger side. It's hitch mounted and you can swing up to 300 pounds out on it. That one starts at $7.99 and mounted on there is our ramble rack that starts at $7.99 and can do up to 150 pounds per tray. And it's the first off-road rated bike rack on the market. Hey guys, this is Christian. I'm with Sherpa Equipment Company and we make roof racks and bed racks for a variety of vehicles. So right here is our sunlight roof rack. And so that's a two piece rack for the Jeep. So if you want to take off this freedom panel, you have the ability to remove the front and then you can leave just the back on. And then we also have our bed rack. So this is part of our pack system. So we right now make bed racks for Jeeps, Tacomas and Fords. And as you can see, we have this little accessory panel where we mount a rigged uh, bike rack. And then we've got the specialized bike and a tent. So the idea behind our rack system is that you can really mount a ton of different items. Uh, so you can see the Rome case, we've got the tent, you can put Rota packs, you can put Max tracks. It's really just start trying to take things out of your bed, out of the vehicle, putting it on top to leave you some extra real estate in the back. All right, so this rack right here, the sunlight is $12.99. And then our mid-height pack system for this vehicle is $899. And then if you order a full height for your vehicle, that's gonna be at $1499. My name is Tiger, I'm with Spider Roof Rack. We're here at a California Overland Expo in Pomona Fairplex. And our main product line is a roof rack. And most of our roof rack that we make, they're all no drill. You can see that we have our truck here on display. That one is a no drill for a Tundra, second generation. And we recently came out with one for the first gen Tundra that is no drill also. And over to my right, we have some more accessory that is a Max Track with a shovel holder right here. And we have some ru rubber clamp stuff. And we also offer different type of uh, powder coating. We do, this, these are just example we have gold, fluorescent color, and our standard black textures that we have available. And if you guys are interested in our product, you can go to our website, it's spiderroofrack.com. Howdy, Spencer T. Hauser here from Suica. I'm here at the Pomona Overlanding Show to demonstrate our e-bike lifter. It's a hitch-mounted rack system that lifts e-bikes and e-motos. Allows you to lower the rack down to the ground, run your e-bike or e-moto onto the rack, secure it, and then with a hand drill or with a hand crank, which isn't as fun, allows you to lift it up into place on the vehicle. As an added bonus, right here, we have a patented quick connect system that allows you to just lift the rack on and off your vehicle and lock it into place. So the lifter system has a 240 pound capacity, 120 pounds per tray. We sell it all together with two trays and the lifter system for $2,600. You can buy it with one tray for 2,000 or you can just buy the lifter itself without the trays for $1,600. If you do that, you can put your own trays from companies like Thule, Yakima, rig supply, just bolt them into place with the 10 millimeter T-slots that we have here and create your own custom lifter system. Hi, Ruben with Raceline Wheels. Here to talk about our brand new wheel, the 958 machine. Comes in 17 inch and 18 inch, or also do it in a 20 inch and a black. Also right here, we got the 951 Rhino in a bronze. This is 17 inch. Comes in two to three different finishes. Comes in a black, bronze, and a machine as well. Right here, we got our uh, 951 RT, which is our cast beadlock. It's an eight lug, 17 inch. It's available online if you guys are interested. We also have an 18 inch beadlock cast, or forged, I'm sorry, forged, uh, which is also available online. Thanks for watching. Uh, you can find us at www.racesignwheels.com. Hello guys, good afternoon. My name is Alex, I'm with Falcon Wheels. Today, I wanna show you these four different models that we have. This is gonna be our UTV ATV wheel the X1 Gunner. Next, we got the TX3, the T8 in battle blue, and then the TX in a new color, all gunmetal, matte. 
And then on this side, we're gonna have a little bit more models that you're more than welcome to check out. <laughs> so over here, we have the same TX3 in black, one of our most popular wheels, the T7, and the TX2 in silver. And then we have uh, the, the T2 on top, the T6, T7 in gunmetal. So then right here, we have the T9 in bronze, the T8, and then the TX1, another of the most popular wheels too. And mostly 17 by nine, six by 139, but we have wheels for mostly every single model. Okay guys, so thanks, thanks for stopping by. You can find more information on Falcon Off-Road on our Instagram, we have Facebook, and then we're located here in Pomona. So if you're local, you're more than welcome to stop by our showroom. Thanks again. Hi, my name is Doug Fletcher with Falcon Tires. And we're here at the California Overland Adventure Show, and we are here showing off our Wild Peak line, the, all the light truck stuff. So right here in front of me is our newest product, the Wild Peak AT4W. And what's unique about this is it's the next generation of the Wild Peak AT line. So the 4Ws are winter, wet, wear, and warranty. Yes, warranty. We've increase the warranty on this to 65,000 on P metric 60 on light truck and kept great sound where it's not making a lot of noise still have the same wild peak AT fashion so great traction with it stability comes with it and it's just an all-around great tire behind me is our wild peak RT tire over here this tire is in between our MT and our AT4W came out last year. It is an excellent tire, an in-between tire. It is also quiet. All of our product is gonna be extremely quiet when you run on our tires. This one comes with a 50,000 mile warranty and uh, is again, a great tire for on and off-road capability. And then we also have here at the booth, the MT, our most enthusiast tire, and our HT tire, which is the highway tread. So if you look around our booth today, you're gonna to see all kinds of vehicles that range from a crossover all the way up to a hybrid. Uh, so you're gonna get the ability to run with every one of those vehicles on our product and have a nice, smooth, quiet, comfortable ride, and then be able to go off-road and deal with anything off-road as far as traction, climbing capabilities, or anything along that line. So here in the Falcon booth, we have the Toyota pickup truck with us, and we're running on this tire, the Wild Peak RT, which is our rugged terrain tire, 50,000 mile warranty, great traction, strong sidewall, three-ply casing on this. So you've got great protection and something that Falcon offers on everything except our most enthusiast tire is road hazard protection for 330 seconds or the first thousand miles so this is a great tire and it's extremely quiet comfortable and you get great towing capabilities out of it nice and stable thank you for coming to our booth today this is falcon tires you'll be able to find this at falcontires.com if you go onto the site you can go in and search out by zip code everybody around you by zip code that sells our products and you'll have it readily available to you at falcontires.com. Thanks for coming to the Falcon booth. Hi, I'm Perry Rubin with ALP Generators. What we've designed, and we've been on the market now for a little over three years, is a 100% propane generator. No more clogged carburetors. Storage of fuel is propane in a propane tank. That's good for 30 years. No more gas cans, not necessary. This is a 1,000 watt generator. It surges to 1,000 watt. Steady running watts is 850 steady running watts. We have a DC power supply that you can connect directly to a battery. You get about six to seven amps of DC power for charging batteries. We have parallel plugs in it, USB plugs, two 120 watt plugs, and then we have an LED light with a switch on it. It's got a low oil indicator on it, and it will shut off if the oil gets too low on it so we don't burn up the motor. It, this model here is a pull start model. We have a primer on it over here, and then we have a pull start right here. It'll take two to three pulls, and it will start every single time. So this is where we connect our fuel line into it. 
This will run on any size propane tank. You do not want to have a regulator on it. So if you're coming off a tank that has a regulator, you have to get rid of that regulator. In most cases, you won't have one. We can run on small tank like this. On eco mode, it's going to last about three hours of runtime on a one pound tank. So if you have a 20 pound tank, that's 60 hours. This model over here is our new electric start. It's remote also. So we have a remote button. It's good for up to about 150 feet. It connects with one of our jump starters. So we connect the jump starter. It'll start and it'll stop all automated. It has an electric two-step motor on it for the choke. So it pulls the choke on, pulls the choke off. Same features as this, as the pull start. This model here, we sell these for $529 online plus $20 shipping. This model sells for $699 plus $20 for shipping. We're outside now, so we're allowed to run it. We're at a trade show right now. We're allowed to run it. And as you can see, here's the LED light, which is kind of nice. It, it lights up the panel as well. It's going to light up the area. And it's got an on and off switch for it. This is how you would shut it off. Just hold the button and it shuts off. This is eco mode. And then it has a higher mode if you're going to have a surge like an air conditioning unit or a refrigerator. This is connected to a larger propane tank. It'll connect to any size propane tank. Propane versus gasoline. Propane has 70% less carbon monoxide on the exhaust and it doesn't smell. As soon as I disconnect this, it's propane vapor. There's nothing in it. You could take this and actually put it right into your kid's car seat in your vehicle. You won't even know it's there. We are Jackery Solar Generator. We do portable power stations as well as portable solar generators and portable uh, solar panels. Right here is our 2000 plus kit. Uh, what you have here is the base battery, which is $21.99 retail price. And it's a 3000 watt uh, solar generator as well as a 2000 watt hour battery. The piece that you see on top is the expansion, the battery expansion pack that actually doubles the pack capacity and you're actually able to add up to 11 separate units on top. This one's designed for home backup and you can actually connect it to a transfer switch, which allows you to power your whole home. This is our 100 watt panel, retails for $299 and it's a good to go panel that folds up and lays out super simply. Um, and it folds up to about this size and is only eight pounds. Over here, we also have our 1000 plus, which is 1200 watt hour battery and is 2000 watts in output. It's a good battery that you can take on camping trips or overlanding trips, as well as power your refrigerator, your cooler, uh, all your cooking appliances. And it has uh, lithium iron phosphate, which is a new battery cell chemistry. And the smallest panel over here, that's actually, we have a book size or iPad size solar panel that is only a couple of pounds and it folds up to a super thin size that fits directly into your backpack. This is our smallest solar panel and it is 40 watts. It charges your phone directly if you want to hook it up to USB-C or it charges our 300 plus, which is one of our smaller units also designed for camping or day trip activities. Hey everybody, I'm Tom with Robotios, and we're out here demonstrating our solar tracking systems today. So we've developed a rooftop mounted uh, solar system that will automatically uh, position the panels to face perpendicular to the sun, uh, which can generate up to two times the energy per day compared to a flat mounted system. So on the roof of my van, we have the Heliotrope 1.0. It's a two axis system. So no matter where the sun is facing relative to the vehicle, we can point the panels uh, directly towards the sun, uh, 360 degrees. And on the ground here displaying, we have our uh, Solotrope 1.0, which is a one axis uh, uh, system. You have to be facing generally towards the sun, but it will automatically find the optimal uh, panel tilt to give you uh, the maximum amount of energy. So with our systems, uh, you can really use your roof space a lot more efficiently. Uh, the, each system is 400 watts and we've kind of sized it to fit 95% of uh, van use case to generate uh, all the energy that you need in summertime and in, and in wintertime. We've also developed uh, our own uh, solar panel specifically to work with our tracking systems. They're super lightweight. Uh, each panel only weighs 10 pounds uh, and they're each 200 watt. We're using the highest efficiency, 24% efficient uh, Maxion SunPower Gen 3 cells and integrate perfectly on the footprint of the roof of a van uh, to be kind of the ultimate, ultimate solar system. We got a ton of automatic features. We'll sense the wind speed and bring the panels down if the wind goes above 25 miles per hour. 
We'll also deploy the panels uh, down flat to the roof if uh, you forget to turn it off and the vehicle starts moving. So we got a ton of features, uh, touchscreen, wireless LCD control to show you all the information about your solar system and yeah, really be the only, only system that you need. Thanks so much for watching. You can find us on social media at Roboteos underscore Inc. or our website, uh, Roboteos.com. Hey, it's Brian with Goose Gear. Just want to give you a quick introduction to the company. We build interior storage systems for vehicles. Uh, we cover a wide platform from Jeeps to 4Runners, Land Cruisers. We've got a Jeep JKU here and a Grenadier here on the show. And we do uh, storage systems for your drawers, for your camping gear. We do camp kitchens for your stove and your fridge and all that kind of stuff. We also do seat deletes and we'll show you all of that in a second. So in this Jeep, we have a camp kitchen system. So there's a camp kitchen, it has a fridge slide and also a stove slide. So there's your stove, pop it open. You can do all your cooking, all your foods here. You've got a drawer that you can put over here. So you can do all your storage, access all your food and get all your stuff out for, for cooking and getting ready for camp. Everything closes up nice and easy. It's all bolted down to the plate system. So everything starts with the plate system for us. So we do plate system. We also do seat delete. So this one has a seat delete in it also. Gives you a little more storage, a little more capacity over there. So this is a, a similar system to what we have in the Jeep over there. This is a uh, Ineos Grenadier, the 2024 model we just started building. So this also has a Camp Kitchen 2.2, which has a fridge, stove, and a single drawer. This vehicle also has seat deletes in the, in the back, which are optional. So if you're gonna sleep in the vehicle, we make platforms so you can sleep in the vehicle so you don't have, necessarily have to have a rooftop tent or a ground tent. And then over here, we got our seat deletes. So seat deletes, you have storage underneath. So this one has power systems underneath, but there is seat deletes under here also. Storage for different things that you need to put in your vehicle, tools, recovery gear, all that kind of stuff. We cover this type of build for forerunners, Jeeps, Land Cruisers. Uh, we also do interior camper systems for the Gladiators, the Tacomas, Rangers, all that kind of stuff as well. So our pricing ranges and varies based on the vehicle and the parts that you're purchasing. Most of our stuff is going to be in the four to $500 range and go up from there. You can find us at goose-gear.com. That's goose-gear.com. Everything's on the website. We have over 200 dealers across the US too. So if you need someone to do a great install for you, we vetted our dealers. Our dealer network is phenomenal. What's up guys? Grant here with Trunkmate. I'm the owner of Trunkmate. We make sleeping platforms for SUVs, minivans, trucks. And we're here in Pomona, California at the Overland Adventure Expo, showcasing our products inside of this 2022 Ford Bronco. And so this is our Ruma Box kit. Our products are all very compact. Um, they fold up very small, they're lightweight. Our Ruma Box kit is designed for storage and organization. You have a locking drawer. This is great for meal prep, cooking on top. You have these removable tops and drawer dividers, so you can do some cooking right from the back of your vehicle. All of our products fold into the trunk of your car, so you don't you can have your back seats free so over here we have a, a demo of what this looks like in the ex expanded form when you're not using the product it folds up and the bed frame pushes all the way in so now you have a compact box that fits entirely behind your back seats in the forerunner rav4 subaru outback all types of suvs and um, it's lightweight, 25 pounds per side. They're modular, so you can lock multiple sides together. And that's what we're showcasing in the Bronco. One other thing that we really pride ourselves in is the ability to sleep in any car, even if your back seats don't fold down perfectly flat. So I'll walk you through to the side here. And this Bronco, when you fold the back seats down, you can see they kind of fold up at an angle, and that's very common with most SUVs, they're not a perfectly level sleeping platform. So you can't just throw a mattress down and expect to sleep great. So with our platforms, they're actually able to level out that uneven cargo floor and they extend beyond the edge of the seats. So even if you're six foot tall, you can sleep and spread out comfortably in any vehicle. Come check us out. We're, we've got a website, uh, trunk-mate.com is where we sell our products. We ship them for free all the way across 
anywhere in the country. And uh, we'd love to chat and uh, give us a call. I'm Mike with Mega Mike's Adventure Products. And we have the audible hot water system and we have a bitchin kitchen and some storage slides. Get, tell you a little bit about it. So with our water system, you can have a full sink. It does provide hot and cold water. It is potable. Gives you a cutting board, 17 inch blackstone grill, lots of space for serving plates of food. We have a spice rack so you can have your spices in it. LED lights in all the compartments. Another cutting board over here. This offers you a silverware tray. You have more storage underneath. Slide this in. Pull out your fridge slide. We have more storage up here with a six inch closed slide. We also have a three inch slide on top of that for max tracks, chainsaws, recovery gear, stuff like that. We have our potable water system over here. This water system allows you to pull out of any lake, river, or stream. It is filtered with a 0.5 micron charcoal filter and a UV light, 19 gallon capacity. Thanks for watching this video. You can find us at megamikes.com. Hey, I'm Andre Charland. Um, we're here with Rux. I'm one of the founders of the company. Uh, we're based in Squamish, BC, and we got a bunch of products here. The core of our kind of philosophy is a system for organizing and moving your gear so you're always ready to get out there. Our main product is a Rux 70. Um, you can see here, it's got a bunch of different components, um, utility rails, it's got a lid, it's fully weatherproof, lightweight, you can carry it in multiple different ways. So you can carry this, you know, over your shoulder, you can carry it backpack style. So, you know, for getting from the top of your truck out to your campsite or from the garage to your truck, the idea is just really maximum versatility. It comes in a bunch of different colors and sizes. One of the key things about this is you can pack it like a box because it has structure, but it actually fully collapses either to the size of your contents, so it can be kept really tight while you're off-roading with these compression straps. Those will come over, and when you cinch it up and pull it tight, uh, unlike a hard case where your, your contents could just be rattling and loose, everything will be really tight in there as you're kind of bouncing down the road, um, so you don't have to worry about stuff getting all shattered. Then it pops open and there's actually a whole series of components you can use to organize your stuff. So this is a pocket, holds about three liters of gear and that can be mounted on the outside for easy access. It's got a little tool divider pouches in there. So that's nice on the outside of your camp, but if you're worried about stuff getting lost, it'll also mount right on the inside of your rucks like that. So it's a pretty slick little system with these utility rails. And the other thing is we have, the Rux bag, you know, good for holding clothes or food or whatever with some divider pouches. And this will fit also right in the Rux. This holds 25 liters um, like that. Slots right in and again, this will clip into the utility rails so it stays really secure in place. And even when you're compressing, moving the Rux, all your stuff will stay uh, in one place. Yeah, also on the outside, the utility rails We've um, been working on these tie down straps. So these are specifically designed, this will hook right into your roof rack like that. And then this can clip right into the rail. And that's a cam buckle. This Hypalon strap is super strong. I use these on my snowmobile, the top of my truck all the time, driving down the highway, no problem. And then again, it's super easy to just come on and off. The other thing we have here is the waterproof bag, and that's also 25 liters. Two of those will fit in there. And this is kind of like, you know, daily driver, tote style, everyday carry thing, but it's also has this roll top closure. And this makes this like a full dry bag. So this is basically a submersible dry bag, you know, for boating, kayaking, what have you. So that's kind of the core of the rock system right there. You know, there's a few other pieces like these utility straps that you can use to, you know, attach like a fishing rod or axe right on the edge. Um, or you could use that to lash it down to something. It's really up to you. So, yeah, that's the thing about Rux is the goal is really to be modular and keep your stuff organized however you want and use it in lots of different ways. Thanks for watching. I hope you're all enjoying the show. It's been great for us so far. You can check us out at Rux.life online or find us on Instagram at Rux. Dot life as well. My name is David and I'm here from Overland Kings. This is a new awning product that we're going to be offering in about a month's time. 
This is a all new Overland specific electric awning. So there is not another awning like this on the market. It is very similar to what you would see on a van build, but this is specifically sized for those Overland vehicles like those Forerunners, the Jeeps, the Broncos. It's gonna fit perfectly on that. So you may ask why electric awning, right? So uh, you may have seen those rollout awnings. This is essentially made to replace those style awnings. Uh, I know you guys can, if you've had one, you know how difficult it could be to pull it out yourself. So this is gonna be a press of the button. It's really that luxury and convenience factor that you're gonna get with an, an awning like this. So, and I'm gonna show you. As we are talking, I'm going over the features. I'm gonna show you this thing's gonna deploy on its own. So at the press of a button, this thing is deploying as I'm talking to you. And that is that luxury factor that I'm talking about. So this thing is a 79 inch 280G rips off waterproof. Uh, so that's gonna be different than our other ones. This is an actual waterproof uh, ripstop canvas. So uh, this is meant to be out in the rain, in the snow. Uh, this is actually our most stable awning in the wind and I'll explain why this has, um, this is aluminum. So this acts like almost as a counterbalance in the wind. Uh, we've had it up to 35 mile an hour winds out in Oregon uh, and that is freestanding. So this awning is freestanding. It does feature those drop down legs and I'm going to show you how those work but uh, totally not necessary if you don't need to. If you don't want to use that, uh, you can totally use it freestanding. So here are those drop down legs that you can deploy out from the side and this will reach all the way down to the ground. So you have that, we have a small extension and you can support the legs here if you do uh, maybe want to raise it a little bit or if it does happen to get really hectic out there with the wind, you're more than welcome to drop down those poles and we will stow it away exactly the same way. Bring that back up, lock it in place, and that stows away right at the end of this uh, at the end of this awning. And yeah, this uh, features LED lighting. So right now we have this wired to one of our controllers. So let's say you are out on the road and you maybe want to check out what's on the left side of your vehicle. Flip that switch on. It's uh, totally auxiliary if you want to have it done that way. Uh, totally optional. But yeah, uh, this is totally electric. If you have like a taller vehicle, this is a little more convenient. So you don't have to get up to the top of that zipper and try to deploy it. So it's just really that easy when it comes to using this awning now. So these are gonna be coming in at 950. Uh, we are running those show discounts this weekend for 20% 20 per, 20 off. This is gonna be a brand new product that we're offering in the next month. So if you're interested, check it out on the website and give me a call. My name is David, we'll, uh, we'll get you hooked up. We have this cool new little product. It's one of those little uh, knickknack things that you may want to have in your vehicle. This is a tire table that we're offering now. It does fold up and you're able to squeeze it in tight into, um, you know, the side of your vehicle here. Uh, this does fit up to, we have these on 40 inch tires. So that goes all the way down to whatever you may have, 33s, 32s, those 30s. Uh, we have it all the way up to 40s. So if you want to use this, this is a cool little accessory that you can add to your camp kitchen setup or your, your vehicle. So as we had the awning deployed here, we're able to cook up a, you know, cook up a quick meal, put together a quick sandwich, put this away. You'll be done in less than a couple minutes to be able to put all this stuff up and put it away. So yeah, this item here is coming in at $150, but we are running it at a show discount as well. So you can pick it up here for the weekend for about $120. So right here, we've got one of our Gen 2 270 awnings. This is an LD version. We actually make two versions of this, which is uh, like I said, the LD and an HD difference being uh, LD is going to go up to your front door. Basically, HD is going to reach all the way to your your hood. So you pretty much are just going to get different coverage with that. So you're going to have the LED lighting that's included in all of our Gen 2 versions. Uh, you're going to have the drop down poles as well. So if you need to have that be more stable during the wind, all of our awnings are rated up to about 20 to 25 mile an hour winds. These are 280G rips off canvas coming in at about 60 pounds, 60, 65 pounds, depending on which version you go with LD or HD. All of them are ready and out, ready to be outfitted with the annex rooms as well. So right here we have a partial. So that has a window. We also have a door version as well to be put on the backside so you can access your cargo area. So as we're going through all this stuff, you're going to notice we have a wide variety of products that we offer. 
everything's going to be based around our main lineup, which is our rooftop tents and our awnings. But we do offer a couple of other little things. So uh, right here we have one of our new products, which is a drawer system that we manufacture for uh, the FJ models and also Forerunners. Here you're going to get your two standard pullouts with these big beefy handles. And that's going to be able to store all your recovery, all your cooking stuff that you may need. And you're going to have a built-in fridge slide. So right here we have uh, one of our partners, Iceco's uh, fridge here, APL 55. And yeah, uh, super, super sweet, organized, uh, clean setup. This also includes the wings to be able to go over the wheel wells. And these, uh, these are going to be coming in at around $1,200, depending on which model you have, FJ or 4Runner. Uh, so about $1,200, $1,300. Um, yeah, these are ready to go, ready to rock. We have these in stock right now as well. So we're going now to some of our main product line here, which is our rooftop tents. Uh, right here we have the Chaska model. So this one's very popular because it has that extended, I guess you could call it a balcony. Kind of gives you the illusion, almost like if you were in an apartment, right? Uh, you have high ceilings. It just makes you feel like you're in a more spacious tent. And it really does feel sp spacious while you're in there. So you're going to have a two inch uh, memory foam mattress in here. Everything is all insulated from top to bottom. This one also is 280 G canvas. Uh, Ripstop canvas does also feature a stargazing moonroof as well. So when you're at when you're camping at night, you could take a peek out, take a look through all that. It is outfitted with LEDs as well already. Uh, shoe bags are already ready to go in there, and great storage as well. So you got all that ready to go does feature heavy duty crossbars. Those are 50 pound load crossbars each. So for a combination of hundred pounds, that's coming in at about 190 pounds of total weight. Features everything you would need to mount it all the way up. Those are coming in at 36, 37, 60. But we are running uh, discounts on these throughout the weekend while you're here. We also have offered different style shells of this model. So depending on your application, we have uh, a floating shell model we have a side opening this is the chaska so this is that clamshell standard model that you can find and yeah come check us out uh, on our website overlandkings.com you can check out the different models that are there and we could definitely help you out if you give us a call over to our office and um, we also are located in rosemead so if you are local to the la area you could come check out our showroom and see the rooftop tents there hi i'm hudson townsend i'm here with Pittman outdoors at the show i'm going to give you a brief rundown of a couple of products we have to offer today so here we have our pop-up tent fits five and a half six foot beds pops up goes right over the bed of your truck has three poles super easy setup blue pole goes in the blue hole red in the red gray in the gray so you're not getting confused with all your poles while you're out camping uh, we also offer truck airbed mattresses that go over the wheel wells five and a half all the way up to an eight foot bed these products run on a built-in pump, turn the dial, inflate, as well as deflate. Uh, runs on a removable, rechargeable 12 volt battery that goes in here. As you can see, this particular bed is a Gladiator. So this is a five foot bed. With that uh, comes in the packaging is this. This is a tailgate extension, now giving you seven feet of sleeping room. Clips in here, one, two. So now you have seven feet instead of five and a half. We also do rooftop tents, as you can see, uh, we have all different sizes. So this is our two to three person tent. This is a soft shell tent, uh, super easy to set up. Universal will mount to any roof rack system available in different colors, orange, white, blue, army green. And then we also have here on this Jeep, as you can see, we have our awning. So this is our 270 degree awning, uh, has LED lights that plug into a portable charger that you plug your phone with. Um, super easy. Legs for stability if you're in a little bit more windy conditions. Uh, we also have this. This is our XUV mattress. Uh, universal to all SUVs. Same pump system that I showed you on the other one. Thank you guys for watching. You can find us on Instagram at Pittman underscore outdoors or on our website www.pittmanoutdoors.com. So my name is Kevin Crayford. I'm the founder of Humbra. So this is our product. It's the Firefly. It's a hitch mounted canopy system tailored to a short bed pickup, but it also works on Jeeps, SUVs, short roof vans. So it's it's designed to be, um, you know, to not live on your vehicle essentially. So it breaks down to 61 inches by 16 by 10, designed to store horizontally in the back of a half ton. You just throw it in the bed of your truck, pull it out, 90 seconds, you can have this thing set up. It's 120 square feet. 
And we got a number of different attachments here. So there's Velcro all along the perimeter here. We call these our canopy extensions. So this widens the footprint to eight feet all the way down. If you want to pull these off, we got other ones that actually enclose the bed of the truck here. You can pull it off the vehicle with an accessory mounting auger, bring this to the beach, to the park, throw it up. You know, you got shade um, essentially wherever you go. You can put it on your deck. Uh, it does a number of different things. It only weighs 37 pounds. It's manufactured in Germany, comes with a one-year warranty. There's no riveted construction in this. We designed this. It's all bolted. If you happen to break something, unbolt it top and bottom. We ship you out a replacement and you're good to go. So this is the Firefly frame with the textile removed. So where it starts here is with this telescopic shaft. So you'd, you insert the, uh, the hitch into your two inch receiver. You take this shaft, you put this into um, the hitch. We got five and a half inches of travel right here. The canopy goes on top of that. So why we have the textile off here is to really just showcase the construction behind this thing. So you can see this shuttle, it's all welded construction here. And what you won't find are rivets in the construction here. So if you happen to damage something, unbolt, unbolt. We ship you out a replacement, good to go. This is the half cock position. So when you insert it into the hitch, what you do is you walk around and you just take these, these um, ribs and you lock them into these channels right here. And you can see right here, this is a custom friction hinge. So this is a 3D printed component. It goes right, right into the channel. You do that all the way around, you walk around and up it goes. So it locks into these pins here. Why there's a series of pins is as the textile ages and expands, it starts to stretch a little. So that's already in there for when that happens. We added a redundant safety pin in here. So if you happen to knock one of these over, it's not gonna come down and slap you in the face. But then just conversely, it just folds up in the opposite way. Let's fold it up. You got these oversized push pins in here. So if you're wearing gloves, you can still operate it. Come down. And then a compression strap goes around here, folds in nice and tight, throw it in the bag, and you're good to go. So you can find us at HumbraUSA.com or on Instagram at HumbraUSA. And um, yeah, we're moving into production in Germany and the next week with a scheduled May delivery. And you're going to be seeing out there, seeing these out there this summer. Hey, everybody. This is Josh with Rome Rest. We're at the CA Overland Power and Sports Show. We've got our booth set up to show up our overlanding mattresses. We have our Pioneer here, which is our four inch mattress with a microfiber style uh, fabric on top to help with fluid resistance. We've got our Scout over here. That is our three inch, no memory foam, down and dirty mattress. Uh, it gets you a good night's sleep and you're not gonna wake, wake up rough the next day. If you're looking for pricing, check out our website. You can go in, manually plug in numbers. If you're looking for variable widths, variable lengths, if you need it to fold, uh, tri-fold, bi-fold, quad-fold, uh, we make it to exactly how you need. How's it going everyone? My name is Logan and I am with Helinox. Today we're out at California Overland Adventure and Power Sports Show in Pomona, showing off some of our brand new products. Right here behind us, we are so excited about this. This is our Cot Tent. Sits right on top of our Cot One convertible. Brand new product. It's launching on our website here in the next week or two. Keep an eye out for this guy. Comes with a rain fly. It's got the body. You can do a mesh body or a nylon body with it. Over here, as far as new product, we got our Table 4. This guy is brand new, runs for 400 bucks, packs down into this bag right here, just about 10 pounds, accordion styles, just like many of our other tables. Other new product that we got is our field tunnel right here. This guy is gonna be launching for just shy of three grand on the website here in the next week or two. Really awesome shelter to use as your base camp with your friends, you're cooking, you're sleeping, you're hanging out, really fun stuff. In front of me, we got a breadth of product here. These are kind of our Tried and true, we got our dog cots, our Savannah chair, sunset chair, chair 1XL. You can trick it out with rocking feet with a cup holder. We got our tables here. You can throw some silicone mats on top, make them heat resistant to 400 degrees. Whatever you need to make your camp comfortable, we have right here. Hey guys, my name is Jags. Um, I'm with Pack Out Campers. We're gonna give you a quick walk around of our camper and all the new one will be the topper on the next one. So, What's unique about our camper is the frame of it. So I can show it to you here is the T-tracks inside and out of the camper. You can mount a lot of accessories for it. A good example would be our, our bike carrier. So which is 
from Kuat, and then we provide them with the mounting system. So right now, if it's close to this guy right here, you can actually carry your bike towards here and lock it. So on the passenger passenger side of our camper, you'll see our Max Track stable. So our Max Track stable is kind of double purpose. A lot of guys tend to ask why you carry a lot of why you carry Max Tracks all the time. Actually, if you have a camper, you can remove your Max Tracks, put under the tire so you can level your vehicle. And then the second purpose for this is you have your cooking table. So you could actually have a kitchen set up here or a camera station that you could have and you can use this table as however you want it to. So right now, close this guy and then you still be able to close the side of the camper, set up kitchen, open this guy and you have your cooking station. You don't have to, re to bring tables. You have like a quick setup because we always uh, change campsite every night anyway. So the inside of the camper on my setup is I have a hot top uh, for my hot shower. And on the other side is our Red Arc system. So the Red Arc is mounted directly to the camper so it can free up the space, especially if you're working on a five foot bed. Um, I'll show you the bed right now, actually. So on our bed, you don't have to touch all your bedding. It could be stored up there. We have three inch mattress, two blankets, and four house pillow and still be able to close the camper easily. So when you're ready to sleep, all you have to do, wrap this guy down and then you have your on entrance right here on the side and this, this panel is up. You also have a space right here that you can move things around and to have an eight foot bed, uh, actually an eight foot um, sleeping space, you drop this guy, now it converts to eight foot and you can also use this as, as a table when it's bad weather outside. And today we're releasing our uh, topper. Um, we have a lot of questions. Uh, hey, are you guys gonna release the topper? Um, here it is. So there's no tent on top of it. It's just a shell, but we would like to offer the most modular camper out there in the market. So you can see on this camper right here, all of the accessories that you have here could be mounted directly to our uh, packout shell. So you could have a bike mount similar to this, or you could actually go with the Kuat bike mount. That's one of the options. And then on, on, this, side of the on this side of the topper, we carry uh, two rota packs and still be able to close the door on this side, or we have like a slot table that's so easy to remove, store from the inside, and all you have to do is, is slide it towards the side to remove it. You can move, your slot table either outside or inside. It is just have tons of options. We're so excited to showcase some of the accessories for it soon. Um, so stay tuned. Hi, I'm Warren with Tune Outdoor. We're here at the Pomona Power Sports Expo showcasing the Tune M1. Uh, we're based out of Denver and the Tune M1 is a lightweight canopy pop-up truck camper. Uh, mounts to any bed, bed size up to the eight foot beds right now build based on bed length, bed width, and cab height. Gives you an east to west sleeping platform. It's always fixed and set up for you, as well as the best weight to space ratio in the market. All of our models come with six windows in the canopy all the way around that are screened in, either aluminum or glass side panels that on and open just the same and are interchangeable. Uh, we've also got halo lighting that runs around the full interior. Um, then different options that you can add on very easily, cab access slider, fan, vinyl window inserts. We've got our new insulation package in this one as well. Um, as you can see, this customer, he built out a lot of different things for his rig. So because all the aluminum is T-tracked, you can really decide to do whatever you want with your build and interchange things in and out very easily by interfacing directly with that T-tracking that exists on the roof, on the interior, exterior, really anywhere you see aluminum, you've got T-tracking on both sides. So unlike some of the other brands, what we do is a east to west sleeping. On a full size truck, you've got 78 by 60 inches. Then we do make a King extender to bring it out an additional 20 inches. And you can slide that up underneath your mattress to get it out of the way if you want. On a mid size truck, you've got 72 by 60. So both are queen size beds, regardless of the size of truck. 
and they're always fixed and set up for you. None of it's obscuring your bed space, so you can still use your truck by, like a truck while always having a bed set up. So every 2M1 comes standard with a halo lighting system. Um, you can also add a rooftop fan and then choose how you want to power both of them. We also have just released a propane he heater system, the Truma Vario heat heater. The propane line mounts uh, here, routes into the aluminum extrusion, runs all the way out and pops out the back where it hooks up to either a five or 10 gallon tank and a bracket that we developed. Um, all of that, you just have to choose how to power however you want, but we've seen every customer use just about every different type of battery that's out there on the market and we can work with it. Thanks for checking us out. If you do want to check out our website, we're tuneoutdoor.com. Our Instagram handles are tuneoutdoor as well as all of our other socials. Feel free to reach out with any questions that you might have and hopefully we'll see you either in a Tune M1 or in our shop sometime soon. My name is Nick Corsol. I'm the Vice President of Sales and Marketing with Alaskan Campers and this is an Alaskan camper. So what you're seeing here, this is an eight foot Alaskan camper sitting on an eight foot bed. So one of the cool features that we really like about this setup is you get all full function, full utilization of your tailgate. So you get the extra security when it's up, you get a nice little landing pad when you're stepping out of your camper. And then with all the modern day trucks now, they got the backup cameras in them and whatnot, you get full functionality with the backup camera, which is fantastic. So this is a really good setup if you're looking to get into something, you're just starting in the camper world, an eight foot Alaskan on an eight foot truck. So let's go check out the inside. So one of the things you'll see right away when you step into an Alaskan camper is just truly how comfortable and spacious this is. It's unlike any other pop-up camper in the space. So full stove top, converts down, you've got dual propane burners, nice deep sink with a sink cover cutting board. You got all the room to do the food prep that you need in here. Not to mention, you know, what kitchen isn't complete without a massive refrigerator? So we've got the Novacool fridge, marine grade fridge. You can basically run this thing upside down. Requires very little ventilation. Absolutely a must have for any enthusiast that wants to be cooking in the kitchen here. Not to mention, if you don't feel like doing all the cooking, right here, you got a full function microwave. One of the great things that we can do with these campers is we can include an inverter, which allows you the full functionality of the microwave and then all your standard household plugins here, which gives you the ability to plug in any household appliance. So you want to do a hair dryer, blender, coffee maker, coffee bean grinder, you name it with a 3000 watt sine wave inverter. You can do anything you need to do with the household appliances. This particular unit, is also equipped with a 12 volt AC unit by Nomadic. So tons of efficiency, tons of cooling ability to keep this camper nice and comfortable in the summer. It also has a forced air propane powered furnace by Suburban that's gonna keep you warm in the winter. The entire camper is insulated in R13 spray foam. So you're truly going to be cool in the summer, warm in the winter. Point you over here, we've got the Red Vision by Red Arc which is their total camper management system. So what this allows us to do is know exactly how much solar we're bringing in, how much battery life we're adding to the 144 amp hour batteries that we got in here. It also has all sorts of different sensors that you can hook up to the different components in your Alaskan. You wanna monitor water tank levels. You wanna monitor fridge temperature, propane tank levels, how much solar you're drawing, how much battery power you have, you have left to use. It'll also even estimate how many days you think you can stay out based on your usage. Right now it's telling us we've got eight more days if nothing were to change. So kind of a fun feature there. So also up here for the dinette, we have the table storage. So table really easily comes out, super lightweight table, lightweight woods used here. Table clips into the rail on the wall, folds up, and you just simply drop the leg down into place. And now you've got your nice dinette, comfortable. You can seat four adults here, no problem at all. And then up above us here, you do have two of the Max Air fans, one over the bed, one over the main body of the camper. And you know when you have one of these on exhaust, one on intake, you can create just a wonderful breeze right before bedtime to cool this camper off when you don't wanna run the AC. This dinette obviously here, folds out into a bed. So when we bring both sides together, you can lay out and you can sleep two adults relatively comfortably here in this particular 44 inch dinette setup. Ample storage, both up top and down below. And if you really need to stretch out or lay out, you've got the full queen size bed in the extended cab over for your comfort. I hope you guys enjoyed a sneak peek at the 2024 Alaskan camper. 
feel free to find us online, www.alaskancampers.com. Give us a call, shoot us an email. We're here to help. Orlando Mistrato with Fair Adventure Vehicles. We are a composite camper manufacturer. We work with Total Composites right now to provide us our composite wall and proprietary extrusion system. This is the best engineered, thermally efficient system on the market right now. The panel system is R12 uh, insulation factor. This has phenomenal cold and hot weather performance. So really great, comfortable living habitat. Love to show you this one. We have a display here at Pomona. This unit is for a uh, full-size truck. It's a three-quarter to one-ton chassis. It's an eight foot bed. This one's got a couple neat systems. We have a forward ski closet in this one, 18 inches wide. That's a fully waterproof. So you can put skis or snowboards in there, uh, fully wet, covered in snow, and uh, no leaks are gonna come out of that compartment. So really nice garage space for uh, a lot of our customers are real avid outdoor enthusiasts. So uh, we try to design these for you know outdoor lifestyle. We use all turn overland hatches and windows and door systems. This unit, as you may have seen before, is running a Rotopack supply for the diesel heater. That's a diesel furnace. This is on quick disconnect. It's easily removable to fill up or to fill up your vehicle. And then coming inside, we have a lot of our like kind of signature floor plan here that we've been focusing on. This one has a lifted floor with a uh, wet well, kind of create a mudroom entry space. Also has additional floor hatch storage. Uh, we still have a six foot five interior height after the lifted floor. So we still have a very comfortable overhead livable space. Yeah, and just some of the great benefits is that it's a very simple system. We're using a composting, separating toilet. Again, everything's very simple in here. There's not a lot of plumbing, not a lot of things to go wrong. We're using a really simple uh, Dometic jerry can system that uh, supplies the sink and uh, use an 80 liter dual zone CFX for this application. Uh, you can also access the uh, garage ski storage from the pair of double doors at the front. This creates a nice access, really nice usable storage, really focused on ergonomics and usability in here. Uh, and this one has just short of a king size bed that's permanently deployed as well. So you can come in, as soon as you pull off the side of the road, everything is just set up. You just pop in here and you're ready to go. There's absolutely no setup. Again, we're really trying to focus on ergonomics and usability. So we're using as big a possible bar sink you can fit in here with a taller single spigot. This just allows you to get like a really nice size pan in here. Again, just the simple usability features that, uh, that make overlending a little more comfortable. This unit also, we have a extended seating. This creates like a really deep, it's almost a 30 inch deep sofa. So you have a very nice lounging, comfortable space. So if you're stuck in here for a long time, uh, like in a snowstorm, you can get very, very comfortable. What that also does provides me a benefit of uh, also additional storage. And in this unit, I have the ability to slide multiple jerry cans forward up under the ski closet. So this is another massive amount of volume for storage for uh, water systems or bed and uh, table system can all stow away in here really easily. Another nice benefit of the hard side is you get the full height permanent closet. So you have just massive coat hanging closet storage. You can even option additional closets in the front. We can configure, everything is custom made. So we do have some standard configurations that we can start with. Uh, or we can kind of build to any level. So this model as well was upfitted with uh, nearly 700 amp hours of uh, lithium battery, 2000 watt invert, uh, Victron inverter. I have DC charging off the truck's alternator. We also have uh, 600 watts of solar on this unit, MPPT charging all through Victron as well. We're also using their uh, seven inch touchscreen, which is a really great uh, system to monitor how you're using power, how much power you have left. It just kind of gives you that confidence of that you're not gonna run out of juice. So this is a great example to show the diversity of the total composite system. We have the ability to really custom configure into any configuration. So this box has actually been made specifically for this service bed. It's very similar to what would be on a typical half ton truck. It just shows the diversity of the product. So stepping into this unit, you can see a lot of the commonalities of our design language. We really try to just keep a very common theme between the builds even though there is a lot of differentiation between the, or a lot of difference between the custom options. So this one's got a forward closet just to increase additional storage. This would typically go on a half ton truck because there's no lifted floor system, which cuts a lot of weight out. So you do supplement that with like a, a lifted step 
to uh, add comfort to the seating height. Also provides a nice extra storage for storing the table. And uh, this one's actually configured with a, just a really simple portable power station for this application. So we can build, you know, with portable, simple systems, or we can get very sophisticated built-in systems as well. All right, we have here is a, uh, another eight foot unit. Uh, this is sitting on an actual six foot truck bed, 6.75 as Ford calls it out. But this is actually an eight foot camper. So you do have it tailgate permanently down or removed. You have a little bit of hanging off the back of the, back of the bed. The three quarter to one ton trucks really don't mind this. I uh, wouldn't recommend that so much for a half ton application, but uh, no problem with a three quarter to one ton. A little bit about the outside. We have a, you know, ability for shore power hookup 110. And uh, we also have an alternating charger hookup underneath for the DC charger off the truck. Uh, it's all Anderson connectors, really easy to plug and play. Keeps that simple, just really, really simple to disconnect and decouple from the truck. Oh, this one has an exterior propane tank. This has a quick release system, so I can just run my pigtail to heat up the camper, or I can have a splitter and run propane accessories, your barbecue, stove top out back here. Just real easy to service and get to. Keeps it outside, which is safe as well. So let's pop into this eight foot floor plan. I've been really lucky. We have so many awesome customers. Uh, my customer actually drove down from Northern California to show off this unit today. So he actually full-time lives in this. Uh, since taking delivery, he's full-time lived in this for eight months. So it's a great way, he saves rent in California. A um, lot of neat features in this one. We've done all kinds of custom stuff. He's got a, this is a peace officer. So he's got a custom gun safe we set up for him. This one has a 300 amp hour lithium battery bank. This also has the DC charging, the solar system, all Victron components again. We have a diesel furnace heater in here. We also have a composting separating toilet in this one. This one's got a really neat feature. This actually has a uh, heat exchanger. So this is only, this is gonna bring in fresh air at ambient interior temperature. So if you're in the snow and it's cold outside, you have all the doors closed and it's warm in here, this is gonna constantly change the air out from in and in from out. And it's gonna exchange the heat temperature so it's gonna be bringing in fresh, warm air. Uh, it's the same, it's gonna match the temperature of the air inside. Um, again, this is like another custom add-on that we can do. Uh, so we can take these projects to literally any level for you. Another thing we really try to focus on is ergonomics. I try to really keep the coolers off of the counters. I, I find the ergonomics of setting something on that cooler when you need to access the cooler, then everything's in the way. So in this case, I just incorporate into the seating area. Uh, this is a, another nice Dometic 75 liter dual zone uh, fridge and freezer combination. And then just above the fridge is uh, our space for our 280 amp hour lithium battery and all the electrical components. Thank you all for coming and taking a look today. We really appreciate sharing this product with you. We've been working super hard. Love to talk to you. If you have any questions, reach out to us at information at bearvehicles.com. Contact us through our website. Uh, love to speak with you. What's up? This is Parker here with Go Fast Campers. I'm here showcasing our fully aluminum and billet and extruded aluminum campers. So from here, you got fully accessible side panels how you access the bed of your truck. These all pop open for easy access, as well as us showcasing our turbo cubby system that allows you to store everything neatly into each different compartment. Moving around towards the back, let's pop the tent open. Give it one easy shove and you're ready to rock. Now let's get into the camper. Pushing through into our Transforma floor. Let's you get easy access from the inside of the camper. Now here we are with your camper fully popped open and what we like to call our cabana mode with the full tent side doors popped open and you're ready to rock. So this is our full platform camper for the top and bottom rooftop tent. Now this guy full price starts at 8,500. That's your bare bones tent with no doors, no windows. So the tent, no side doors, flat on that guy. And the front has flat panels front and rear. The windows front and rear at about $400. And the tent side doors at about 500. Yeah. Getting no windows and getting no tent side doors gets you a little bit more budget friendly. But with that, you have your full platform camper. This is our Armadillo Hoverex uh, inflatable air topper. This whole entire unit is completely air inflatable. We have a frame system attaching 
to the bed clamp, well, using bed clamps. We have a mesh screen on the back and also a window. The top will support up to 250 pounds. We have strategically placed D-rings that will support up to 150 pounds per uh, D-ring. You can check us out at armadillousa.com or you can follow our Instagram, Armadillo USA, as well. Hey, uh, my name is Robin Cook. We're here at the California Overland and Power Sports Expo. So I'm the owner of Truck Boss Decks. Um, what these are, are decks that go on the back of pickups to haul pretty much anything. As you can see right now, I have it set up with a ATV ramp. It's all stored underneath the deck. It's all dry and secure storage underneath. And uh, for safety, uh, we just use a winch to pull these things up and down. So you don't have to ride it or become a YouTube sensation. So these are our new pack boxes. They're great for overlanding or for work, play, things like that. All solid aluminum, um, lockable storage. Uh, just a very, very nice product. Now also these will slide out with the sides of our deck, depending on what size load you have on the truck. So just super handy, dry and secure. Motion, uh, motion sensors for lights. Everything turns on as soon as you open it up. So over here, I usually just carry, you know, emergency supplies, first aid kit, fire extinguisher. This is a rip bag, so it just comes off and, you know, can send out and, and get it to whoever needs it. So just all the storage is, is just key because now I know where everything is and I have a place for it. So in here, there's just more gear. I have, uh, all kinds of things that I need in here. Shovel, usually if we're out in the winter. On the other side, I also carry a chainsaw, chainsaw gas. Because as you know, if you're on a road and you don't have a chainsaw, there'll be a tree in the middle of it. If you don't, if you do have a chainsaw, there'll be no tree. To find us, just go to truckbossdex.com and check it out. Because we got something for everybody, for sure. Have a good one, guys. Hi, I'm Irka Poliacek from Tivole Fabrication. This is my like a side uh, hobby business. And I build whole district myself, including uh, awning sewing, uh, upholstery, uh, powder coating, laser cutting, bending, 3D modeling. So this is true built by two hands. Front bumper quarter inch aluminum T6. So every single bend is actually welded both sides and then freehanded grinded. Then uh, I got uh, my own air jacks for leveling and change tires, which are operated by phone, so you can dial pressure and lift it up and down. Then uh, I make my own beadlocks to put bigger size, and also I can easily change the tire. Uh, cooling fins for shocks. I also have my own uh, control arms, front axle control arms. Same time you can see I have a 23 gallons water tanks under the uh, body, so it's completely hide it. I just finished last week the awning. I have to purchase sewing machine, learn how to sew and finish because it has to be only two hands. So I need to learn all skills. This awning is 360 and it's built in. So when I close the awning, it's actually completely hide it. Camper shell, all body, it's aluminum, 1.8, uh, welded, grinded. So it looks like uh, plastic, but it's actually metal. Uh, this is barbecue stainless the storage boxes i make uh, for outdoor kitchen and like extra food we carrying we got uh, rear bumpers swing arms uh, latches locking system all i designed it uh, myself even these latches are designed and built from scratch you can check my youtube channel tivole uh, tivole power wagon tivole off-road and you will see all the builds from scratch The interior, it's all aluminum powder coated, so uh, it's a uh, low maintenance and lightweight. Front window, it's uh, sealed with a cap, so it's 24 uh, 7 open for extra air to breathe. And you can uh, store stuff on the rear seats and you can pick it up anytime where you want. So the, the, the camper looks like this always. You don't have to move boxes, you don't have to slide drawers. It's always ready when you open it. Also, I have on the top of the roof AC 12 volts. All system is 12 volts except uh, the induction oven. This is an inlet for uh, filling up the water tanks under the cap on the front. And right here on the computer, 
You can see the level of the water each tank and also temperature each tank. This is outdoor shower. So we got cooktop, sink, the refrigerator, heater on the front, AC on the top. This is survival vehicle, so we have some kind of bow and knives, chainsaw, in case we need it. Right now, weight 11,000 pounds, fully loaded with the water and everything. So it's not that bad. And the body is aerodynamic, so on the freeway, if you go 95 miles per hour, you don't feel the size, you feel only the weight. The philosophy of all this build is this track has to be built by two hands. So it means uh, upholstery sewing, uh, awning sewing, powder coating, uh, welding, grinding, 3D design, uh, water plumbing, air system. Everything has to be built by two hands. So I built everything myself with no helper, with no any crew. Hey guys, how you doing? Lauren with X-Grid Campers, and we are here in Pomona at the California Overland and Adventure Expo, and we're super excited to represent six of our partners. We have about nine off-road trailer brands that we sell. We have two locations, one in Las Vegas and one in Knoxville, Tennessee, and we have six of the brands here on site with us today. The first trailer I want to show you is the Teton X made by Atlas Outdoors. Uh, this is built out of St. George, Utah fantastic trailer. If you have a family of five or six or seven people, you can get everyone inside this small little 11 foot hybrid pop-up. It has airbag suspension, great setup, outdoor kitchen, a lot of room inside. Let's go take a look. So out here we have an outdoor kitchen, great slide out. We're using the Camp Chef stove on this trailer. This gives you two 20,000 BTU burners. So it has a lot of capacity for those bigger meals when you're, when you're cooking for a big family. So it's a great setup here. You have hot and cold running water to the sink, nice prep area that drops back or slides out the back there. We're covered by an OVS 270, or this is a 180 awning with our tent, but it also comes with a 270 awning if you don't do the tent off the rear. On the front, we have the storage area. Um, you can get this optioned up with a turnkey kitchen package. So you have all your accessories, uh, your utensils, your nesting uh, pot and pan set, set up in here. Nice little prep area or dining area if you want that. And we have the uh, Dometic 75 liter fridge on the slide out. What's really nice about this setup is the Dometic fridge can be accessed from inside. So on those cold nights when you need a little extra snack or something, you can actually get in there, open up, get some food, get a beverage if you'd like to. Let's take a look inside. So now we're inside the Teton X and what's amazing about this trailer is how much room you have in here. Um, right now we have it set up. You have a dinette table in here. You can turn the bottom bed into either a queen or a king so you can have it set up different ways. This right here has the single bunk as a 24 inch bunk, but you can do this as a double bunk. So this can be a 48 inch wide bunk to have either one or two kids up here. Of course, the parents down down here with the queen or king bed. And then we also have a single bunk right on the front of the trailer right here. This will lift up storage, single bunk right here. This is an option. So you have a nice internal sink with plenty of cabinetry storage. So you can wash your hands, brush your teeth at night and never leave the space. This also has an option for a cassette toilet cabinet with a hidden toilet in there. So tons of space. These trailers come equipped with up to 490 watts of solar. Um, we do a 270 amp hour game changer battery by Battleborn in it. Um, and we have a 12 volt AC on the roof. So it gives you a lot of power, a lot of capacity. We're running Victron for the solar charger and the DC to DC. So it's set up really well for off-grid travel. So one of the most unique things about the Teton X is the ability to add the rooftop tent on the rear. So this gets you that expandable living up to about a family of seven. So we have a rooftop tent. It's built onto this molly panel set up on the back above your spare tire. This is unfolded right now. Nice little two, two person rooftop tent with your rear ladder. Get up there and all folds back in. You don't have to disconnect anything when you travel. Just folds together, stows away. And this is another great option for the Teton X, which is the, the dual cut dual shower. So with as larger families, especially you can have half the set aside for a toilet area, dry room, and then your shower over here. We're running the uh, 
Truma hot water system. So you have the, uh, the, the, the shower, outdoor shower, um, really nice setup. You have a roof on it if you want to. So it's a great way to, you know, be outside, you know, camp in those remote areas and have plenty of luxury. So we're also here highlighting the uh, Australian Off-Road Sierra ZR. This is a fun little tough camper. If you're really into aggressive terrain, you want something lightweight. This is about 2,000 pounds, but it carries up to 52 gallons of water, has 200 amp hours of lithium batteries and a 1,000 watt inverter, capable of the largest rooftop tent. So you want a lot of space, you want to carry a lot of gear, and you want something super rugged that you can still tow with a Jeep, this is the way to go. 100% built in Australia, 100% dust proof, one of the toughest little campers on the road. Let's take a look. This is set up with the ARB fridge, nice big area, lots of prep space here. Pull out slide for the sink. We're using also another Camp Chef t uh, a stove on this one. Tons of prep area, storage back here for all your kitchen gear. This is running the Red Arc Red Vision, so you have a lot of power control, a lot of capacity there. So on this trailer, we're running the Bush Company 270 awning. Uh, it's a uh, freestanding awning, truss style design, holds up very, very well in wind. Love this awning on this trailer. As we walk around, we have a big storage compartment. This goes uh, pretty deep, about four feet deep back in here. We have the clamshell design tent on this one, so you'd have uh, access with the, with the ladder on the side. But we can do a fold-over tent as well, so if you want to have a fold-over tent come down here, you can then enter from on this side with a ladder and an annex, and then you have your closet storage down here. And then tons of storage on this side, as well as your hot water shower and your privacy tent for your shower. So one of the other trailers I wanted to show you is the track trailer, this T-Van. We import this one from Australia. This is actually the first one ever in the United States. We're very excited about having here. What people love about this trailer is only 2,400 pounds, but it's super, super rugged. The, um, the track trailer has actually built this suspension for the Australian military. So it's been through the test of time out in the outback. Um, this thing's been through some of the harshest conditions that any trailer has been on, and it's really, really well built. So, but it's still very, very light. Uh, what people love about this trailer is the ability to expand it with this deck and this interior uh, living area. So we open this up and now we have a nice area for either cots, for kids, or you have an internal kind of um, you know, dining area, lounging area when the weather's bad, lots of room to stand up, move around. And then we have an attached ensuite out the side here. So you can get in here at night, you can wake up, walk outside, use the bathroom, and you've never left the comfort of your, of your cabin. So the kitchen on the track T-Van is really fantastic. Everything slides back in. So you have your sink um, that drops down in and then it'll all slide away. You have your three burner cooktop, plenty of storage. Nice large windscreen around the kitchen area. That'll drop down and everything slides back in. So it's really tight, really compact. But as you can see, tons of prep space. We're covered by the quick shade awning. So this is a very unique awning made uh, by Superpeg with Track T-Van. Covers up the entire thing. You can see it's totally freestanding right now. Holds up excellent in wind and rain because of the shape of it. We can put optional legs down. So if you have heavy, heavy wind, we can tie those down. And then we can also set this up as a full enclosure with an annex room as well. So if you want more space out front, we can do that. We can also put an attachment family room on the other side of the tent. So a lot of versatility for this little trailer to have interior, exterior living space, a lot of capability, good for a couple, great for a family. It works well for a lot of situations. So this is the front of the track T-Van. It's pretty striking. When people see this coming down the road, they don't know what it is. Again, this trailer is only 2,400 pounds, garage height, set up really well. We have solar on the roof, spare tire, dual propanes. We're running the arc jack uh, on the front and we're running Cruise Master DO35 for the coupler. So come out, take a look at us, X Grid Campers. We'll show you this trailer and everything else. And the last trailer I want to show you guys today is Sky RV. So we're very excited about introducing this new product into the United States. Uh, the owner behind this build has been in the RV and caravan industry out of Australia for over 14 years. He's bringing a new product to the U.S. that we're uh, super pumped up about. This is the first prototype. We're going to show you around a little bit. If you want something that's super capable, airbag standard, 1,300 watts of solar standard, uh, up to 900 uh, amp hours of lithium batteries, 80 gallons of water, 
are suitable for a family, a couple for some of the smaller units, up to a family of four or five or six, you can do that here. We have the 14 foot on display, but we're also gonna have a nine foot, 11 foot, a 16, 18 and 20 foot coming out soon. Let's take a quick look. So this is the kitchen of the Sky RV. Um, really nice setup, tons of prep area, lots of storage. You'll notice here that the bed's gonna sit high, so that gives us a lot of room underneath uh, for all of your kitchen area. So lots of storage for uh, prep trays. Um, we have a 100 liter fridge. We're gonna have a barbecue um, set up over there. We have a sink that's built into it. We're gonna be running a nice propane stove or an, an option for an induction stove on this. Plenty of coverage a lot of storage, very, very well done. What people love about this unit is the interior space and the openness. We have a ton of room height, uh, head height above us, nice large queen bed, pillow top mattress, very, very comfortable, large dinette area. Uh, so you have a lot of room. Again, this is the 14 footer and we have plenty of space in here. This will come often up with uh, either a single or double bunk. So a family can four can fit in here comfortably. One of the nice features about this uh, dinette setup is the table is stowed inside underneath the bed. And so there's no legs. And so what we'll do um, is release that table, comes out, slides out, and now we can sit down comfortably with no legs and plenty of room. So on the 14 footer, we have a little kitchenette with a, with a sink. Again, plenty of storage. We do have an interior fridge plus the Dometic fridge on the outside. So you have two fridges in this. You get to, you know, really convenient for, you know, carrying extra drinks and food, but also have access to some food when you're inside. So a nice little setup there. We also have a composting toilet set up right here with a full shower. So this is the front of the Sky RV. Tons of storage up front. Uh, this will have an air conditioning setup as well, uh, come standard. And uh, again, we're running the Cruise Master DO35 on it and uh, airbag suspensions come standard with it. So if you're looking for a really well-built off-road caravan with all the bells and whistles, it's not a ton of upgrades. Everything's coming standard. 1300 watts of solar, you know, 300 or 600 amp hours of lithium batteries up to 900 and the AC unit, uh, 80 gallons of water. This is a fantastic setup. Come into the US here in fall of 2024. Uh, if you have any questions or want to visit us, want to learn more about these trailers and the other brands we carry, uh, please check us out at xgridcampers.com or visit our showrooms in Las Vegas and Knoxville, Tennessee. We'll see you soon. Hi, I'm Kevin Cooper with Snow Trailers. Today we're in Pomona, California. Today we're going to go over and talk about one of our trailers, Alpine, but we actually have three in the family. So we have Alpine, which is designed for our Jeep truck guys. We have Baja, which is designed for our Subaru, CJ, small SUV guys. And then of course we have Recon, which is designed for ATVs and UTVs. Now we're gonna do a detailed walk around with the Alpine. We're at the Alpine rear section of this. This is our kitchen zone. So the kitchen zone has a stainless steel pull out with plenty of drawer storage to store all of your storage, you know, spoons, supplies. You've got a solid stainless steel top. You can put any cooktop you want on there. You have plenty of room for prepping. You've got an integrated stainless steel sink. You've got an integrated stainless steel backsplash with some spice racks and paper towel racks. All of this comes into its self storage and slides away for easy uh, storage. Above that, we have a fixed storage rack that allows you to put loop straps to carry all kinds of dry goods and all kinds of food products. And then next to that, we have a full pull out drawer slide that allows you to access all of your storage bins easily without having to lean inside the trailer. While we're back here at the rear section of the trailer, you'll look down here and you're gonna see this beautiful sign that says Fabtech Suspension. So we have a full integrated Fabtech Suspension in this trailer. It allows you to do some serious off-roading or mild off-roading and just gives you a better ride. You'll also see arc leveling jacks back there with a full trailer hitch with a nice recovery system on it. Also, you'll notice we're in a two, under a 270 degree awning that goes all the way around that's unobstructed. We have nothing in the way here that allows me to come over to the prepping station. So I've got my kitchen zone. Now I've got my little fun zone. I've got coffee, pull out drawers, very easy with lock systems in there, upper, lower locks, lights, radio systems, inverters, our Renogy onboard power system. And of course, nice, easy on and off light switches for the whole trailer. Plus you have 12 volt outlets, you got USB outlets, everything you would possibly need to power any of your electronics. 
Then of course on this trailer it has an option with a uh, inverter on it. That's powering our TV today. So that's kind of nice to have out sometimes. You want to uh, video stream a football game, baseball game, whatever it is, you've got access to the TV. As we come down here, you notice this trailer is actually outfitted with 37s. That is an upgrade. But everybody asks us, will your trailer fit 37s? There's the, there's the answer. Yes, it does very easily. All our trailers come stock with 33s with those, with those method wheels on it. As we come to this uh, second section, this is the refrigerator zone. We use an ice coast system up here. You can use any refrigerator system you want, but it allows you to put a 70 liter or smaller in here. Everything's powered, easily stores away. Also something unique to the snow trailer is our awning system. We are in the up position now. It's a simple hydraulic uh, gas system in here, gas assist. You just pull the pin, the whole awning goes up six inches. During transportation, comes back down. Then you'll also notice inside here, you see print two lights and print two bars. Our rack system in there allows you to put spare racks. So you can put tables, chairs, you can put um, any kind of uh, roto packs in there. Anything else you want for storage for long term fits right in that rack system. Also on the front door here, you're going to see a molly panel. So all our doors come with molly panels, including the lids wherever we can. That allows you to have nice little areas to mount stuff, flashlights, hatchets, or just simply cooking goods. And as we come to the front, you're going to see behind the doors, you're going to have two panels. One propane panel here, it's now in the actual rear position, uh, powering up the uh, cooktop. You've also got a power pack in here. All our trailers come with 100 amp AGM batteries, a polycarbonate protection panel, and behind that panel is a Renergy 50 amp DC to DC. We've got a NOCO battery charger, and we've also got the Switch Pro's control module with an on and off switch in there. Everything goes all nicely tight and sealed away with a nice compression lock, and it locks into place. You'll also notice the finish on here. This is a 3M rock guard, basically, uh, you know, uh, to help, help, help the protection of the powder coating. So uh, it's, it is a 25 mil protection uh, finish on there. This is B&W Hitch's articulating hitch. This is new to the market. Uh, you're going to see these pretty quick. We're actually helping them prototype this. So this is a very cool feature. I love this. It's very quiet. It articulates 360 up and down. Uh, but what I love about it, it doesn't make any noises down the trail. It's very quiet. Here's our front arc system. This helps us move the trailer around when we're in the shop or in your garage, but it also has enough power to level it up. And if you want extra leveling power, you've got two mounting points there to put Kurt levelers up there. Now, as you see, you're gonna see a lot of goodies up here. You got a Max Trax behind a dead space area. So behind the toolbox, we put a Max Trax mount on there. You've got another Molly panel, a, a first aid kit, another propane panel, and then we get to the fun water stuff. So this is our water distribution outlet inlet. So this actually supplies water to the water heater that gives you water to the shower. It's the right to me. When this shower is in transportation mode, it articulates and gets tucked away all nice and neat next to the tent. Now let's go around to the house side. So on this side is our living quarter side. This is where you enter the tent. This is where you have your health and beauty aids. You got more storage with custom bags. We partnered with a company called Overland Vehicle Systems to make custom bags for our side boxes. They also make garment bags, trash bags, but they also make some very cool health and beauty aid bags. So everything has a home, everything has a place on the trailer. So when you're on the trail, it's very easy to deploy. And when you're off trail, it's very easy to put in here. Here's your entrance to your shower, water, shower and porta potty area. So it's got a nice little section with, drip, uh, with zip down windows, zip down doors, and very easy access to your hot tap uh, water temperatures and water flow. As we come over here, you'll see a water fill to a 35 gallon belly tank system. So all our water tanks are over axle and as low as possible to keep that center of gravity low as possible. And then of course, if you pop up here and take a peek in here, this is the new Everest tent from OVS. It fits perfectly on our trailer. We have tons of room for it. And it's uh, one of their newest ones they have on the market. Then of course, you're gonna notice all these lights. So all our trailers are equipped with a ton of 12 volt USB outlets. That allows the customer to do what we did here to kind of showcase. We've got lights on both sides. Here we're kind of simulating a camping environment. I've got a trailer on this side, a trailer on this side, and we're both having fun camping out in the environment. And again, that, I'm Kevin Cooper. This is the Alpine model. We're here in Pomona, California at the Overland Show. Today we're going to talk about the Remington R20, which is the middle of the row trailer in our fleet. We have an R12, which is full size and an R410 behind this, which is the small size. 
Today we're going to talk about the R20 and do a walk around. All right, so on the rear section of the R20, it's a little different than our normal size. We actually have the refrigerators on the back side, the kitchen on the front, but we use the same concept. We have the 270 degree awning encapsulating the whole side of this, so it's open concept, but we have some really fun features on this trailer. Not only do we have full extension glides on here that allow you to pull in and out, all these trailers are pre-wired for 12 volt. This trailer comes standard with a Remington cooler on it, but this is where the fun begins. As you come up here and take a peek in here, this is a keypad that allows you to have and transport your rifles. So this has been cut out for Remington 870s. You can have two shotguns in here and actually have two ammo, uh, three ammo boxes in there. Nice little keypad that locks in, keeps it secure. Same with the lock, locking trays, all the trays are in there. And of course, leveling jacks, just like our uh, full-size ones. So those are arcs, another recovery system, another wet box in here. So you can put all of your uh, wheel chucks and stuff in there, anything that's kind of dirty. As we come over to this side, again, unobstructed, this is all full walkthrough. We've got a nice camouflage 270 degree awning on here. Again, on our gas shock system, so it's up. I got plenty of headroom in here. You got plenty of storage on this side. You've got a nice small condensed um, panel in here with power. You can turn lights on and off. You got rack lights you can turn off. You can turn rock lights on. You have a nice stainless steel compact system. So this one has a recessed kitchen with a nice Dometic one touch water distribution. And you get a nice single burner cooktop. Now we've got another fun feature. If you zoom in here, you can't really see it but if I push my thumb up here on biometrics, we actually have a little gun vault that drops down. So on these gun vaults, what's nice about these, we'll do some custom lasering. There we just have a little fun testing gun in there, but we can actually laser cut a holding uh, foam system for any kind of gun that you want to buy. Again, holding true to our full-size trailers, every door has a molly panel because you just have so much from them. And of course, spikes, racks, wherever we got. There's our uh, makeshift dog uh, snow right there. So that is the uh, little dog pad we got. Then as you come to the front again, you've got an articulating hitch with B&W. You've got a nice toolbox that has plenty of storage, a polycarbonate panel protecting all your electronics. You've got uh, batteries, uh, chargers in there. You've got solar converter chargers in there. You've got on off switches, another Molly panel, another safety pack, propane tanks be uh, behind the protected panels as you come across here. So that way when you're on trail, all the mud hits this and keeps all of your components nice and clean, very easy to entertain. This one, we actually put a max tracks mat mount on the front instead of putting the shower, but you can put an optional shower on here just like the full size that articulates out. Has a water heater that opens up. You open this door up. You got more access, more storage. You can put a water heater right here. Then as you come around under the tent, you've got another storage rack system, plenty of storage. And again, your water fill for your water tank under underbelly. This one actually has what we call the Sherpa tent, another hard rooftop. But if you take a peek in there, so this one is a little smaller than the other one. This is a two man tent. But if you notice, it's very deep, has a ton of leg room, has a nice integrated sunroof in there. So you, you when you're sleeping, you got plenty of room to move around for two people. You're not cramped in there and it is a nice blackout. So this material is very thick, very black. So when you want to zip it all in and, and sleep in, no problem. And again, this is the Remington R20 by Snow Trailers. Hello, I'm Tim Alinsky. I'm, I'm here in Pomona. We're showing off our pin drop travel trailer. And this is a 100% solar powered self-contained micro camper. So what we, what we mean by that is you can go out indefinitely with this camper. It can stow up to 44 gallons of water. Uh, and it's all solar powered, so you don't need to worry about hauling a generator or plugging this model in at all. Steel chassis, steel frame, uh, lots of upgrades possible with these. Shade awnings, solar shower, bike racks, kayak racks, onboard air compressors, uh, you name it. So they're really versatile, uh, all-inclusive camper. So this is our galley kitchen. So we have a two burner stove here, comes standard with 12 gallons of freshwater storage, a hand pump faucet so you're not wasting electricity or water. Plenty of countertop space, and these just shove right in and close the hatch. When you're ready to cook, you open the hatch, pull these out. Got your fridge, storage all around your fridge. Like I said, lots of countertop space. And the U-shaped galley is really great to, to cook in, so you got everything right at your fingertips. Again, two burner stove, storage underneath, storage underneath here. 
put all your cookware in here, dry goods, you name it. So this is a two burner stove. We have a little wind flap here in case it's a little bit windy. Put this up. There's storage underneath. There's storage underneath here for everything. And we also have a Rockford Fosgate sound system out here. There's surround sound outside, surround sound inside the cabin as well. Got task lighting, under cabinet lighting, USB charging ports. We even have a receptacle for 110 if you need to uh, grind some coffee or make a margarita with a blender. We've got everything right here in the kitchen for you. Okay, so here we are inside the cabin. This is a queen size mattress. So the cabin uh, is 64 inches wide and 81 inches length. So even if you're a tall person, you'll fit in here, no problem, be very comfortable. These walls are super thick. They're very well insulated. We get R15 insulation. So when you crawl in here and shut the doors, it's extremely quiet and very comfortable in all climates. We've got storage in here. We have USB uh, charging docks and cigarette lighter charging docks, even a 110 receptacle. Lots of lighting throughout. And the lighting is dimmable. We've got a charge controller in here. So you can keep, a, uh, keep an eye on your battery charge. We've got a remote control here for the inverter, which turns on all the receptacles that are 110. Then we have a radio, which again, surround sound here in the cabin. We got a fan up here, it's two directional, three speed. Keeps you nice and cool in the summertime. And beautiful Baltic birch, beautiful uh, maple cabinetry. It's really a very comfortable, uh, comfortable camper. Hi, I'm uh, Brian Seeley with Arrow Teardrops and we're based out of Wilsonville, Oregon. So we manufacture custom teardrop camping trailers. Uh, we have, uh, this is the steel. This is one of our flagship models. Uh, we also have the steel in a high clearance uh, version, which has the you know, all-terrain tires, wheels. And then we also build a square drop called the Burnside. And then we also build uh, 60s style retro campers. So we have a good variety of products. So the trailer we have here at the show is a good example of our steel model. All of our trailers uh, utilize 3,500 pound axleless suspension from Timbrin. We're using a, a composite side now. It's a polycore siding that's over Baltic Birch construction. Everything on the trailer is CNC cut, all the cabinetry, everything latches. So uh, in the cabin here, um, we have what's what we call our interior table. And this is uh, on a, on a uh, swivel arm. So you can move this table you know, out of the way to get in and out. And then it also comes apart and folds or drops into the floor uh, so you can unfold the bed. And the bed is really close to a queen size. It's six foot eight in length and then uh, 55 inches wide at the mattress. And then the sidewall, from sidewall to sidewall, it's uh, 58 and a half. So we have, yeah, we have a, just a lot of options that we can do inside here as far as the table, stereo systems, uh, solar controllers. We can do the light leaf solar panels on the hatch, add rhino rack, max fans. So we're very customizable as far as um, all of our different features go. And this galley is our uh, fridge slide. This is an Iron Man fridge slide with a Dometic refrigerator that slides out. This is the CFX 335. And there's a nice big center storage cabinet, pretty deep. You can fit a lot of, a lot of goodies in there. And a two burner stove. And that connects to the propane bottle on the side of the trailer here. You've got uh, full depth cabinets here. So just like your cabinets at home, 12 inches deep, you can put a full size dinner plate in here. You're, you know, you're not having to buy like really compact dishes and things like that. So lots of storage, the shelves are adjustable. You can, you know, adjust it to accommodate whatever you want to haul in here. So over here's the Hardy electrical system. So this is a power center. You've got all your 12 volt fuses, your 120 volt side. There's a battery charger uh, mounted in here as well. And then uh, just some other 12 volt power ports. You've got a 12 volt power port and a USB port switch for the lights and then a 120 volt outlet for when you're plugged into shore power. If you're interested in our trailers, you can find us online at aeroteardrops.com. Uh, you can send us an email at sales at aeroteardrops.com or give us a call at the shop. It's 503-597-8714. Thanks for watching. My name is Jeff Baker and I'm the owner of Hike Outdoors in Mid-Missouri. So today we're gonna to show you the 2024 Trail Runner from Hike Outdoors. This is a five by eight teardrop camper and 
One of the really unique properties that uh, this camper has is the wood plywood panels that it's made out of. So over the last year, we've been working with a company uh, to develop a new plywood panel that has cork as the core. And what that does is it allows us to now create a panel that, that absorbs sound, allows less vibration for the camper spending much of, the, much of its time off road, and then it used cork in other ways throughout the camper. So we found that that through the use of cork in doing all of these uh, doing all of these things with with reducing noise and, and and resonance and vibration, we also get the benefits of the thermal reflectivity or insulative value of of cork and the ability for the cork to absorb moisture. So. Uh, inside of this camper, you'll see that we've got a headliner in there that is made from raw cork. While you're sleeping, it allows the condensation, the, the moisture that, that you expel when you're breathing to be absorbed slowly into that cork through the evening to reduce the amount of condensation that you have on the ceiling and walls. And then during the day, that condensation begins to release itself back out. So you'll see this is the cork headliner. Uh, we've got it on the footboard and all the way through the headliner. And the, and the headboard in this, in this camper. And then in other places, we've used cork on top of, of our cup holders or phone holders. That's the places that you can visibly see it. And then in the galley as well. So throughout the galley, you'll find uh, cork on top of all of the, the surfaces. So, and what that does is it allows us to, to have a place to set things down without making a lot of noise. In general, this camper is just gonna be a quieter camper. And in the process of doing all of this, we just found that, that taking a hike never sounded so good. The camper itself is just a quieter camper, allowing for you to enjoy what's going on around you with less noise. So we've integrated cork onto the, any of the surfaces that we can. That allows you to be able to, to pull a phone out, throw it up on top, nothing's banging around. It also is, it creates an anti-skid surface, so things will stay in place better. We've also got a couple of storage cabinets back here. So we leave these pretty open so that you can store whichever, whatever gear you want to. Uh, we know that a lot of folks come purchase campers that already have gear. And so we try to create as much open space as possible so that people can design and set this up however they want to. We can do custom shelves, custom drawers, um, different things like that if somebody has a specific request, or we can leave it completely open. This camper also uses a, a jackery for all of the power. Uh, it's a great option for being able to have 110 power to charge up a, a computer, but also provides all the power we need for a full weekend of, of camping, running the fan, leaving the lights on, that kind of thing. Hey guys, so my name is Chris Miller. Um, I work with Off Grid Trailers. So we are a Canadian manufacturer out of uh, Edmonton, Alberta, Canada. So right here today we have our 2024 Expedition 3.0. So this is the new RVIA certified. So when we take a quick walk around, we've got it outfitted with the 23-0 Armadillo A2 rooftop tent. Um, we've got the shower swing arm bracket there, the Kestrel. You're outfitted on this unit with your simple solutions like your hot water on demand, your furnace, your AC, things like that. We've even gone as far as putting a TV in this thing. So let's take a walk around and check this thing out. So with the Expedition, you get things like your um, fridge. So this is the upgraded fridge. This is a Truma 69 liter dual zone. It'll come standard with a 55 Dometic. So this is on a walking tray and slider. So tons and tons of storage space inside. Moving forward, you have your cabin. So in the cabin of this unit, you can sleep too comfortably. You have basically an RV queen bed inside. If you take a peek in there, you also have uh, your shelf on the right, TV on the left, and AC roughing in the top left corner. You also have your control panel there with your furnace, your inverter, USBs, plugins, outlets, all that kind of fun stuff. Moving forward, you get into the kitchen area. So this is a Dometic uh, higher outtake propane cooktop. So dual burner cooktop, and then you also have a hot water on demand system. So hot and cold water at the top, cooking here, all the amenities. So in the rear, you have your fully adjustable storage. So tons and tons of storage space in here. You can pick and choose how you want to lay it out. Up top, you also have a folding table. So this is a custom box that we build in house. Comes with an adjustable folding table, pops out, easy setup. 
Down below, this is where it gets more interesting. So you have your 31 gallon water tank inserted in here. You also have a rear hitch receiver. So static weight at its base is good up to 400 pounds. For every one foot you extend, you cut 100 pounds. But out here, you're at about 250 pounds static weight. So enough to hold a bike um, or a couple, depending on your needs. So down below, this is our full custom um, trail arm suspension. So this is the Evolution Series suspension created by Fabtech and Off-Grid Trailers. So this is uh, eight inches travel, um, two and a quarter inch dirt logic shock, just an all around totally capable suspension. Uh, you have your stabilizer jacks here, just easy lift 30 inch jacks. So up front we have a 26570 R17. So this is a full size half ton truck tire on a six by five and a half bolt pattern. Down below here, we have a max coupler, fully articulating hitch. Standard seven pin comes with our trailers so that you can control your electric brakes. Uh, chains, breakaway cables, and then we're running an ARC XO750 jack. Um, so this is fully articulating, fully adjustable so that you can uh, adjust to different heights of suspensions. Uh, over here, we have a 10 pound standard propane tank. So this will run anywhere from one week with a family of five all the way up to three weeks with a couple dependent on usage. When you get over here, you can see that you have a shore power connection direct, and then you also have a uh, solar port. This is all standard from factory. So your three ways of charging are gonna be shore power, solar, or you can actually also trickle charge through your seven pin. All right, guys, it's been a pleasure. For more information, you can check us out at offgridtrailers.com.